Hey there, everyone. <laughs> well, the price dream. Look at this. I want to. I want to be a wizard. So, shall we go ahead and take our little journey into a magical little one wonderland? Oh, and before I forget, unmute game audio. <laughs> That would have been bad. That would have just been like Bioshock all over again. <laughs> you have no idea how long it took me to figure out how to redo the resolution so my computer would not be overpowering all the other sounds. God, this thing takes so much of a uh, graphic hog, I guess you could say. Uh, biggest question. Is there a beard? Beard? I don't think you're the beard, guys. To do. That's a nice little coloration, I guess. Let's see here. What's the closest to my hairstyle? Wait a sec. Oh, I just realized something. Oopsie. <laughs> oh, look at me. I'm behind my game. <laughs> uh, how do I... How do I do this again? I think this is... No, not that. There we go. What, what is with the little gap below my character? That's weird. Can I... How do I do this again? Oh my god, my, my mind. Oh well, I guess we'll just deal with that little random black bar at the bottom. <laughs> Let's see. That's kind of close. Oh my god, it faces. I guess that works. Let me bring the little mic down just a tad bit. Should do, what is that? Oh, look, ooh, that kind of looks like a little bit of a tattoo in there. I, I, I look like a very young Doctor Who, but with white hair. <laughs> Just realized that. <laughs> that was quite something. Hmm. I am. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. A few... It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Oh, that's a definitely... That was quite something. It was wonderful. I... I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. That was quite something. Huh. That sounds weird. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. That was quite something. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. There's some kind of weird reverb right there, it sounds like. It was wonderful. I, I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. That was quite something. A few. It was wonderful. It was I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. 
Well, of course we shall be me. I'm a wizard. Oh, I didn't mean I didn't mean to do that. But oh well, we're venturing forth. Daddy ho. Ah, it appears we are almost ready to depart. Hello, Professor. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well, have we? I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me. Tony. Oh, God. I had water in my mouth when that happened. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Eliazar. George. Glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theater goers in the West End. <laughs> <laughs> it's been much I like him. I like I received that, your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eleazar. Why not? Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? Who's listening? We had a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea. As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. I'm so, Ages I'm so since I've been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. Well, it's not gonna stay. It's, it's not gonna be polite for much longer. I can tell you that much. I need. I want all the dark magic. I love it. I shall become the ultimate dark wizard. Yes. <laughs> oh. Warner Brother Games. And you think it's just throwing my eardrums, guys. Oh my god. I might need to turn it down even more. Glad I caught you before you left for Scotland. <laughs> just barely. <laughs> and who is your traveling companion? A new student. New? Yes, sir. Yes, I, I am know. starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Really? Or have I? Of course. Why well, are people not allowed to come in later? Is that their magical what, what's wrong with that? Huh? Years huh? Now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone wizard. to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> Have you seen this? Oh, yeah, I forgot their newspapers are alive. Uh, I forgot about that. Opinions differ <laughs> as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he Without a dragon. is a significant... Was that a dragon? And Why the fuck is there a dragon next to our cart? I don't like that. I don't like that. Who That's very concerning. Activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl. But with no correspondence, I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly. Oh. To keep it safe. Secret. From Ranrock. What's in it? I want to I know. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. And of it course, I like probably know how to open it, don't that I? That symbol. What's that glow? Yeah, yeah, there it is. I don't see a glow. Of course. <laughs> Nor do I. Just happen to be in the carriage. It's the, th the thing that they for happen to 
be looking for. Okay. Okay, I see how it is. Merlin's beard. How did you wait? It's a key. We do. Wait, fucking god, what the hell? God damn! I knew it was not a good idea. There was a dragon near us. Oh fuck! Well, are we seeing that thing? Oh no. Uh, yes. Yes. Gallop. Gallop. Go. Run. Starting off four now, isn't it? Holy fuck! God damn! Squirrel. Are you alright? You're hurt. No, I'm fine. Tis but, a, tis but a flesh wound. Take this. It's Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. Wiggle weld? Bottoms up? I live, what bitch. Happened? Poor George. I can't believe he. He got eaten. What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage midair? A typical dragon would never. Professor? You tell me dragons are the apex Sir, creatures in this world? They're always. That's concerning. I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? Look around. An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. Get up! I'm feeling better, sir. If you'd like to look around a bit. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Oh, why? None of my buttons are doing anything yet. Damn lion. Slowly but... Oh, God, the brightness. I don't like that. Oh, it actually hurts my eyes. Far did that port key take us? Evil Citadel? Farther from London than the carriage traveled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. Sir, those ruins. Do you think. The port key was meant to lead us there? I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for I don't a think reason. anyone usually. And I believe or that typically. she. What does that seagull and do? now George died in pursuit of whatever oh, it, it was is. meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can Absolutely find a positively. path, however faded it may be. Oh, now I move. Mind your step. Where Junk. do you suppose your wife got the poor key that brought us here? A Nothing good question. Why. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long-forgotten form of ancient magic. Wanda. Down, up, down, up, down, up. You know, you know. A wizard gotta get in his wand ups every day, guys. Gotta get his wands up, up. Gotta be prepared to cast those spells. Roll. Where we going? I want to. I want to see. Ancient magic. Ancient yes, a powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Ah, oh, yes, you mean us. <laughs> I heard a squish. Hogwarts Castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah. That's the path down below. This way. Tell you. But sir, why was your wife oh. searching for evidence oh, of Jesus, lost Professor. magic? 
Right, I got Mary me like that. God damn, you ran right fast. Powerful like magic flash. disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Ooh, pretty wall. Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. Oh, right trigger. Oh, that was pretty. Excellent. Use your camera to select an active file. Some players prefer to select targets and move the avatar with the same thumbstick. But no, that sounds horrible. I wonder if I could turn. I wonder if I'll be able to. Oh, slide. I wonder if I'll be able to turn my magical energy purple instead of red. That was a bit rougher than I'd expected. Fuck that pocket. Your wand works improving with every cast. Thank you, sir. Can I. Is there like a targeting thing where I can freeform it? over there. More dandelions. Ah, ah. Controls. Alright, Professor, you go that way. I'm going this way. I found the chest. 59 gold. Let's go. I got the money. I got underwater for money. Why, where, where am I going with my voice? What the hell is that? <laughs> We're close now. It's just ahead. Bam. There's a little something down there on the right. Steady yourself! Reparo! God damn! That was... Oh, that was beautiful. I fucking love it. Oh, oh that felt... That was fucking beautiful looking. I love that. God damn. Fucking thumbs up to the goddamn graphics team. Holy crap. Almost there. Can I can I can I go down? No. Okay. I'm slowly coming. Why they slow down my movement, I don't bam. 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 Oh. <laughs> okay, I'm having a little too much fun with that. <laughs> Why would someone have built this here? I suspect they valued their privacy. The privy. Oh, let us in for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems. Can I have the goblin? Have a place. That goblin, our place. Oh God, what is this? The main map shows you surroundings with you. In the middle, this is your current objective. Roll the talk of quest objective details. Okay. Neat. Professor, this statue. This may have been his home. I know Merlin exists kind of in this game. Is that Merlin? Okay, I got, I kind of got I kind of got to turn down the freaking volume a little bit more. Oh my god! Like seriously, the music is like so loud. We'll see. We'll see how thirty is. I've really not noticed the difference in that. Oh my god! 
I have been trying to turn down the music since, since it was at a hundred, and it still is so loud. I actually noticed that difference that time. Holy crap. Oh. Combat roll. Combat roll. Bam. Bam. No pottery will escape my sight. Professor, it's a mural of some kind. Perhaps our host was a noted seer. Interesting. I able to jump down there? Does not look it. Literally just doing that. That enchanted crystallized stone again. Got it. If, it, if I'm having that much fun just destroying pottery, I can't. I can't imagine what the, what the rest of the game is gonna be like. What's this? Ooh. Professor Fig. Me. Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? I don't see anything. There's that glow again, like the glow on the port key container. Do we do we touch? What in Merlin's name? Godric's heart. Where are we? I don't believe it. What don't you believe, Professor? What is it? Please, tell me. Oh, oh, okay. I never run. I can look for myself. <laughs> I was waiting for the camera to turn itself. I hear snoring. A little goblin, maybe. I see that up there. Hello? Hello there. I would like to make a withdrawal. <clears throat> Yo, wake the fuck up! It can't be. Those are some big eyes. Hello. We exist. Who are you? Uh, just a moment. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> I mean, he did just wake up, so he has Welcome. to be. It's hard. To, he has to be having trouble moving. Vault number 12, I presume. <clears throat> Precisely. <laughs> the key. Mm hmm? Your wife's port key. Oh, yes, of course. This way, then. Stay close. God, I'm our God, what the fuck's going on? Ooh. After you. Inside the cart, if you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> that does not look like a cart at all. Huh? 
how many volts are there? Hundreds. Hundreds? Mm. In fact, you'll see quite a few on our way to vault number 12. As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The vaults you see now are the newest. Oh, that's are neat. I love that. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. And we Only smile. one with great wealth or power, or both, could what have arranged for such a service. Right you want to take a breath? <laughs> a what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Ooh. Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Dang. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. That is... That's a little grand. I feel like that's probably a long time ago. Look at them, Kelly. Look. Oh, I love that. I want the top hat. Give me the top hat, bro. Vault number... Vault 12. Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. On, On your, your way. way. <laughs> What was that? I don't like the way he's scuttling off. Or what was on his arm. Uh-oh. Professor, mm -hmm. the armband that guard was wearing was glowing. Like the glow you saw on the porky container. Now I'm darker. I saw that same glow on the dragon's collar. Yeah, what was that? We were just wondering about that goblin back there. He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. Probably because everybody that had the thing down there is dead. Here we are. When was the last time this vault was accessed? A goblin has been mm. stationed at my desk for hundreds of Ooh. years. In that time, no one has visited Can Vault 12 until today. What is that? Ooh, ooh, give me the chest. 54 gold! I'm glad I got that in time. Cinematic. Ooh. Thank you for your help. Oh, okay. <laughs> My third little flick is so funny. It's like, ow. Can I talk to him? No? Alright. God! What damn, do you that's suppose a we ball. should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait. Best of luck. <sighs> oh, Professor, God. that was certainly unexpected. That, that, that best of Let luck actually think. scared me a bit. It sounded like someone there was behind be me. something here. <laughs> hmm. Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Uh, oh god. What the fuck? Steady your wand and gut. Guided along the path to learn to spell. Press the corresponding input on prompt to celebrate good work. What the frick? Ugh! I didn't know I had to push it myself. I thought it was just going by itself. Revelio. V. 
There, I saw something. Move a bit closer and try again. Oh, well, 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 I want to take a little look see. I got some goblets, a lot of them. Yeah, this guy loves goblets. We did a book. A door. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to. I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Yes. Lead no. the way. Let me touch it. Only good things happen when you touch mysterious magical items. And nothing bad will ever happen. Ever. This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our Revelio. way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? Well, I want just a jerk. I do. Circuits. But to what end, I can't say. Okay. Stay close. See, yes. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. What the fuck is disapparating? see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. Lumos! What happened? When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. There's a man Are you all in the right? ground over there. Yes, sir. I'm fine. Are we Do not questioning the man? The floor to change. That statue. What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Revelio, I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. We're gonna fight that, aren't we? It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Uh, Wait. Why is it spinning? When you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. Spell time. You're not getting me red. You're required the one light lighting. Wait. Yes, lightning. I thought that said lightning for a second. I was about to be like, lightning, let's go! Charm, Luminous, which has automatically been slotted to your spell slit. Oh my god, my... God, my language filter, what in the world? <laughs> Luminous creates a light at the tip of your wand to help you see in the dark areas. Alright, but how do I do that? Lumos, oh. well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. Yeah, that's me. It does follow the light. Okay, that was pretty cool. Oh, oh, that sound does not sound good. Stay close! Okay! <laughs> Lumos. I'll get my own little light out. 
Uh, Professor? Professor! Professor uh -oh. Fig! Oh, Professor, no. where are you? This isn't good. Okay. Where am I supposed to go? Well, obviously we're gonna follow the little lights. What's happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Ah, that's where they're leading. Let's go again. Let's do, let's do it. Lumos. Revelio. I suppose I'm on my own this time. Tego to stun enemies will with a stupefy counter spell. Stun enemies take extra damage. Oh, okay, okay. Let's go! Oh, oh, oh god, there's one right next to me. gets me. <laughs> Wait, of course I know. I'm from the void. Oh. Oh, what is that? I I'll be with you in a moment. Why is there so much? Oh, why is there red around me? Oh, why is there red in the distance? Can we get to that? Oh, apparently I'm not allowed to go that way. Okay, never mind. Revelio. I see that. I see that. I want it. Loot. Anything else? See anything over there? Aha! What be? A little potion bottle? did you... What is this place? I don't know. But I found this floating above that... basin. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive... for viewing memories. Oh. So essentially the... I ma wonder... Magical words version of a camera? VCR?
I just got that. Follow my lead. Ah, yes, let us drown ourselves. All is in place. The path oh, is well hidden. Perhaps too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this I, path with powerful secrets. I don't know. I was able to... I had the ability and I was able to do it. And I'm not even a full yes. student. And if we are correct, Charles, the ritual wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge. And the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, I just died happened. in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. I just happened to somehow you, find my way to you. Are the key to understanding why. We will. It all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in here. I was right. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. The big I old gun boss. To think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. Uh, no. How about that? Uh, sir, they have the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. Oh. I, I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have one. Ah, yes, yeah, he's gonna die. Yeah, he dead. I have no patience for traitors. What the fuck do you mean traitors? No. Where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well... Perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. Right. Is it time to fight? Oh, oh, you made the vault angry. You made the vault angry. Oh my, oh damn. What the fuck is the armor from Thor doing here? Sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Right, whatever that weird metal armor Where he's wearing is. 
That, that looked pretty badass. It can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both, wanted someone with your ability Ugh. to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Oh, God damn. I just cracked my neck and I heard like 10 different snaps, guys. Oh, that was so good. Also gave me a little bit of a slight headache. <laughs> Look at that train. Oh, that just looks beautiful. Once again, the music is kind of destroying my ears. Port Key Games? Okay. <laughs> snake in the corner come on guys you know what that you know that's gonna be oh you maybe you can't see you can just see a little bit of the head poking all over my shoulder <laughs> what the fuck is that a mongoose the sorting ceremony I'm no expert but that seems more appropriate now <laughs> I need to study this locket as soon as I can but first I must contact the ministry they need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock for the moment I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me of course sir gotcha thank you for now not until I, became, until I become the new Dark Emperor. Ah, oh, she seemed terrified. Phineas Nigellus Black. Prepare yourself to meet the headmaster. Oh, well, I thought he looked Vic, like a qu quite nice a dapper of you fellow. To join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has. Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. I don't like him so far. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. Hello, oh, I exist. Professor Weasley. We've Weasley, what? Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. I shall sit my butt upon the, tip, the stool. Oh, great hat. Tell me where I shall be. But we all, come on. We all know where I'm going to be. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. I'm looking forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Hmm. Indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit. But your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. I feel like he would have just said the opposite. Mm. Of what he just I said, if I pick the other one. Mm. I detect something in you. 
a certain a sense of... of... What, what is, is it? <laughs> is it ambition? I may seem single-minded, but it is important to go after what you want from life. Hmm, interesting. You've recently learned that you possess a rare ability. Man, we're having quite a conversation here. a growing sense of ambition, an eagerness for power. Perhaps you belong in Slytherin. Gotcha, right there. Now, it's known for cunning, ambition, and hunger for power. <laughs> Yes, except Hello there. Hello, you Shira. belong in Slytherin. Yeah, there we go. Red and Slytherin. So much of Claude. <laughs> And Amelia just dives out. Oh, okay. <laughs> and one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. What? Enough! It's not as though I've banned flying altogether, but don't tempt me. So far, you I am here loving to focus it like no on tomorrow. your academic futures. I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. There's so much intrigue that I am so I curious. Said, I must explore as I'm much sure as I can. I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Was that a hint to go away? I guess it was. Okay. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm... Professor Weasley, would you be oh. so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. Yes, show me to my new abode. Oh, okay, more cinematic. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. It may be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. I can be quite resourceful. I suspected as much. This is the entrance to the Slytherin common room. In order to enter, one must simply speak the correct password. Aspiration. Very well. Kind of rail, kind of rail on the nose for Slytherin, isn't it? <laughs> Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. And to you too, Shiro. I mean, Shiro. Oh, God, I, God, I am not having the capability of sleep of talking tonight. <laughs> but yes, you go, have, you go have wonderful more sleep. Looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. Now, where is my chest? I sh is this my chest? I have DLC c items. I want I want to put on my pre robes. You know what? I know there's auto save, but that's a lot of that's a lot of saving slots. Revelio. Oh, thank God I can run in here. Thank God. If I had to walk that slow everywhere in here. I hope that was an apple I ate. I 
I could go down there, but can I go in here? Oh, I can! I'm just gonna eat their apple as well. Revelio. Secrets. Level one lock. I can't open it. Can I? Can I break it? Nope. Okay, let's see. Down is for potion. What about... Uh, okay. What about right? Rebellion. Uh, oh, okay. Um, is start... I wonder... Controls. Yep, there we are. That's what I'm looking for. It's the aim. Open tool wheel. Use tool. Charmed Compass, Quest, Heal, Revalio, Spell Menu, Interact, Ancient Magic Throw, ooh, please don't tell me Telekinesis is somehow Ancient Magic, like, is that, how is that not common magic for people? Can I, oh, I can, good, 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 I need to. I'm actually going to change it up for a quick moment. Uh, and then we do this, and... Ooh. I don't know why I never thought about doing that sooner. There we go. Better. Oh, I guess I need to click when I'm back on over here. There we go. Access map, access view. I guess I don't have the ability to look at like skills or Rebellion. stuff yet. Oh, oh, that's just the apples. Revelio. I see no magic in here. Let's see what I can steal from people. No, that look like anything. Ooh. What a striking place. Oh! Quite the portrait one day. I would want to be hung next to you. Talking mirror. Ooh. Wait, what happens if I do this? Revelio. Either way, thank you, Mir. Mm. I was complimented. Well, this Mir. Nope, that's not a talking Mir. But the fact that every Mir has a reflection, that's actually kind of cool to me. More rooms to go invade in the other way, so let's go back. Uh, I think this was my room, wasn't it? Revelio. I, I think it was. Yeah, it was. Wonder, wonder who my roommates are. I suppose some introductions are in order. I have arrived. Look at me. <laughs> why why did that make me so happy? What the hell? <laughs> I can't imagine starting music this late. A little room, everyone. Let them through. Oh, okay, I'm actually hearing chatter in my head. Okay, I was so confused what about what I was hearing. What is that? Peanuts? Candy? What are those? I don't know what those are. Rebellion. Oh. Why are you crying, huh? Why are you crying? 
Oh! Oh, that was... Uh, oh. Oh. I... I'm sorry, sir. I didn't mean to hit you in the, uh... Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> but will the sale same happen over here? I am curious. No, no, not the same reaction. Ooh, what's back here? Level three lock. Okay, I can't get in there. I want to be in that chest. Revelio. Spin. Oh, that's just more apples. That's a lot of apples to eat. I'm very getting like an achievement for eating all these apples. Cupcakes. Oh, look at the little teapots. Oh, that's neat. Just the fact that that's environment. I love that. Level two. Cake. <laughs> I love the fact that I just ate it like a, like a, like Rebellion. a freaking, um, how I would eat like a, the apple. Oh my God, that was great. My God, there's so many desserts in this room. from everything. Maybe I'll get an achievement or something. Mm. Oh, oh, yes. Apple. Oh, what the? Off limits to me. Oh. <laughs> it startled me. Protego. Lumos. Let there be light. No light. Light. No light. Light. No light. Light. No light. All right. Now can I go up this? Yes, no. It refuses me. I have been denied. That is not helpful. Maybe that's not helpful. Can I help you? Ah, oh, you're the new fifth year. Yes, it is I'm I. Sebastian Salo. Welcome to Slytherin. Thank you. Not everyone has a ministry escort to school. He was a friend of Professor Figs, who merely joined us for the ride. Still, <laughs> impressive. Dreadful way to go, poor fellow. Glad you and Fig are all right. It was dreadful, certainly, but quite an experience nonetheless. Mm. Interesting perspective. How did you Never and Fig manage get, to escape? Almost getting eaten by it's a dragon. all still a bit of a blur, to be honest. Didn't mean to press. You just get yourself settled. We can talk more later. Yes, I have to develop my cover story more. What book were you reading? A spell book I picked up. Has a few interesting things, but not exactly what I was looking for. I'm sure you'll find out soon enough. But not every spell you may need can be found in our assigned textbooks. Dark magic? Are you saying some spells aren't taught at Hogwarts? Which ones? Seems I may have met a kindred spirit. <laughs> that is a conversation for another time. It was good meeting you. Good luck today. To you too, Sebastian. That was your name, right? Oh well. Oh, uh, I'll maybe figure out your name later. I'm terrible with names. Is that a is that a miniaturized mummified mermaid or is that just a wood carved mer you know I'm gonna guess it's probably miniaturized mummified that seems more appropriate what the fuck what was that I didn't mean to do that. Oh, an aquarium? Oh, that's neat. I love that.
you, the law of the stream is just going to be me gawking about how how neat, how neat this game that, is, guys. <laughs> Ugh, not going to move there, are you? Here, watch this. Don't say I didn't warn you. Checkmate. Told you. Please don't ask me to play chess. I have no idea how to do it. You should have listened to me. Ah, oh, I know who you are. You're the new Slytherin. The one who barged in with Professor Fig last night. Interesting tactic on your first day. Taking all the attention away from the first years. I'm Amelda, by the way. Shame I wasn't with you and Fig. I could have lured that dragon away. My skills on a broom are legendary. Sure thing. We handled it. And I think you're underestimating the nature of a dragon. A broom would have been kindling. <laughs> <laughs> Not the way I fly. Perhaps one of these days I'll show you a thing or two about flying. I can teach you more than Kagawa ever could. Speaking of which, what? I'd like to get in some time on my broom before classes. Do you have a lot of time to fly during school? I make the time. There's nothing like swerving through the spires of the castle and around the Quidditch pitch to clear the mind. Are you a keen wizard chess fan? You knew that boy was going to lose the match. Not really. Much too sedate a pastime for me. Also, it's simply not that challenging. The moves are always so obvious. Why does no one else see it? I don't know. I don't know how to play chess. Not much, much the less wizard chess, apparently. Goodbye, Amelda. Nice meeting you. Spin. I, I think I heard one. Heard what? Hmm. Doubt mermaids find us that interesting. Mermaids? What? Ah, based on all the chatter when you entered the common room, I'm guessing you're the new fifth year. I'm ominous. Ominous Gaunt. Nice to meet that you. That is a name well, right you there. You certainly had a memorable arrival. Well, if I'm going to make my mark here, I had to start right away. <laughs> You're definitely in the right house. Do let me know if I can be of any help as you navigate your first days here, though I doubt you'll need it. Were you expecting to be sorted into Slytherin? Most certainly. My family on my father's side are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin, one of the four founders of Hogwarts. Well, that damn. Not something I'm especially proud of, mind you. He was obsessed with blood status, a pure blood maniac. Unfortunately, most of his descendants do not fall far from that tree. Did that student say he thought he heard a mermaid? <laughs> yes, but I've never heard of a mermaid showing up outside our common room window. It is fun to play along, though. But, been known to keep some first years on the lookout for hours. Okay, no, I think of that. I thought those were baby sharks in the background. <laughs> Thank you, Ominous. Very nice to meet it you. It took me Pleasure so much willpower up. not Don't not to do the song. Is the new fifth year Slytherin in here? No. The Weasley's waiting for you just by the stairs. Okay, damn it. Can I? No, can't break it. Hold on. The Kraken. Oh, attention. Good morning. I know, I trust Professor. you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the master and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. 
Oh. Here you are. Book. What does the book secret hold? Oh, oh, damn. Oh, God, it's, oh, God, it's trying to kill me. What is it? Very dramatic. It's a wizard's field guide. I love it. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Ah, where did I put it? <laughs> Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. The book spying on me. me. And we shall put it to the test. I feel like the book spying on me. All right. This way. One second. Here. One moment, guys. I need to go grab something. Let's do. Yeah. I just realized I haven't had a I haven't essentially had my supper yet, so I need to drink my little shake. Get my chair back, guys. Come in. Come to me. Gotta get my controller. Why do I always put it so far away from me? Shaky, shaky, shaky. That flew away from me. Wow. That, how the... What in the world made that fly? <laughs> ah. Oh, okay. Ooh, what's that, though? No, I want this. I, I don't know what this is. I House certainly chest. would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. What is that? Please, Professor, I don't want to walk this slow, please. Oh, God damn. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding lore. Do keep up. I'm like right on your heels. Why don't you cast Revelio on that statue and see what details the field side can be done? Revelio. Ooh. This statue depicts the Kelpie. A ship ship a ship ship. A shape shifting water demon native to Ireland and Great Britain. Which usually takes the form of a long man maned horse. The largest Kelpie ever reported in the local is the Loch Ness Monster in Scotland. <laughs> okay. I, I, I love that. It's, it's the Loch Ness. <laughs> okay. That, that's great. I love that. Okay. Field Guide Challenge. Your progress toward completing challenges appear here. Appear where? Delve Pages and Hogwarts. Challenge is the only way to acquire experience points or XP. Uh, this is your withering level. Experience earned from challenges increase your level and power. Your field guide tracks your current challenge progress. Select the challenges menu to continue. Is that help? No, yep, that's outside my headset. Maybe I don't want to select it. Maybe I want to be a re Okay, fine. Field guide pages. Collecting your first field guide page unlocked a new challenge category. New challenges you unlock throughout your adventure will appear here. Select field guide page to continue. Each challenge has tiers. Special rewards unlock at each tier you complete, from appearance to critical upgrades. Appearance? 
Transmog. I love that. That that's one of the things I'm gonna definitely love about this. I I can just pick an outfit. It doesn't matter doesn't matter how horrible the armor looks. If the benefits are good, I can equip it and it still looks like something else. That's that's number one thing I love. Mm. Rewards must be claimed from the challenge menu. Come back to collect rewards you have unlocked. But what's with the chest with the eye? Huh? Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like oh. that. Oh god. Inside and outside of the castle. It got so angry. Uh, the door didn't form, dude. That was funny. Wait, can I do it to the teacher? No. Ooh, what about that? Ah, good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker. Your field guide contains a map of flu the castle. Flame? Open it up and find Central Hall. Ah, oh, okay, there we go. Got my little shit again. Oh. I profess... Oh, I don't know why... Okay. Hogwarts is divided into two main areas. The left side of the map is where students and professors live. And include the House Commons Room and Great Hall. They say the left side of the map, right? Yeah. Like the Grand Staircase region. Oh, god damn. I want to zoom out. Can I zoom out more? No? Okay. In this view, you can see the flu flames available in your in that region. I love that flu flames. Green flu flames represent flames you have discovered, including your own house comms room. Gray flu flames reveal the location of undiscovered flames. Oh, okay. The right side of the map is where you'll find academic points of interest, including the astronomy tower, library, and greenhouse. Library. Professor Weasley has unlocked the central hall flu flame for you. Use the right an analog stick to rotate the map and fast travel to the central hall flu fl Ooh. I wanna take a look. Mm -hmm. Fast travel. And here we are. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Activate. Hall. Tippy tappy tappy tippy tappy tippy tippy tappy. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. Revelio. I heard that. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Yeah, I probably lost a lot. Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. Or in a the mastery wall. <laughs> of defense against the dark arts <laughs> is required <laughs> for those who aspire to become auras. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever gifted Professor Hecate in charge of our students' education in Hecate? that regard. He can't. Okay. <laughs> you mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all wizarding village in Britain and is home to an array of shops and pubs. 
You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. What will I learn in charms oh, class? Butterbeer. Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes. All terribly be useful. useful. I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. He's a clever and entertaining wizard Ooh. and a talented teacher. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Yes. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. Uh, of course, You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. I'm sorry, Professor, but I'm afraid that's all there is to it. Hmm. Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. Speak of the devil? I was about to say that. Fick, your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. I don't... Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. And invaluable to me. As I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. You are spying yes, on me. I Come knew it. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. Mm, where do I? <laughs> okay, that's the wall. That's the wall. Ah. Revelio. Oh, you. Hey! This ornate fountain features intricately carved statues of denizens of the magical world, including a set of stone sirens encircling the stone the fountain's base. Oh! That's right, I just completed a challenge. Pretty sure I did. Gear up. Appearance reward. Spectacles. Hogwarts regalia gloves. Oh, oh, okay. What do these are? Oh, what's in collection? What, what is it? Oh, enemies. Oh, those little stone statues were not considered enemies? Okay. Ooh, ooh, that's right. Let's go to my gear. Can I? No. Outfit? How do I? Hat. Harry Potter. <laughs> Black leather gloves. Ooh. Being fancy over there. What are they? Natural beige scarf. Doesn't really go with my outfit. Traditional school robe. Oh, I'm wearing it. Okay, okay. I'm wearing a onesie. 
<laughs> Where are the onesie? <laughs> okay, I'm very confused. I thought I could, like... I thought there was a... Look at my inventory now. Or is it in collections? Okay, there's year. How do I get these? Those... How do I get these? I want to put these on. See, what else is in here? What do we have? We got two of whatever these are. What is this? Oh, okay. Those are the pages we have found. That be challenges. That be quests. Welcome to Hogwarts. Welcome to Hogwarts. Outpost? I wonder what that is. Can't do anything with my wand yet. Room upgrade. Wait, what? Oh, come on. What? Oh, come on. Look at that. My hair. My hair is sticking right through the hood. Oh, come on, guys. Wait, change appearance? Dark. Oh, look at that. Okay, 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 okay. Change appearance. Okay, first off, um, no robe. All right, all right. Look at that. Oh, I look fancy. Now, we, we got, we got to look quite fancy. Okay, 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 I'm figuring this out. I'm figuring this out. I don't want to look too evil yet. I need to at least still look like that. What would I look like with this? That does not... That just clashes so much. Wait, I wonder. I wonder. Doc. Oh, okay. Yeah, that goes good with my hair. My hair doesn't go into the singing magic, but for right now, we'll just look like that. Okay, if I put the hat on, then come over here. Or it's hat. I don't really like that. I don't really like any of that. This hat doesn't really do anything either, so we'll take that off. Let's see. Silver rimmed spectacles. Gold rimmed. Hogwarts regalia. The Dark Arts mask. Now we're not wearing anything. We're not going to wear any of those. Black leather gloves, dark arts gloves. Eh? Black rivet gloves. I'd rather red, red rock the black leather gloves. I don't know. Most I change is my fancy undershirt. And, oh, the door. Oh, wait, I was just there. <laughs> Collections, quest, map. Level, I'm so curious about talents. Progress through the main story. Progress through the main story. Okay. <laughs> I'll be with you in a moment, Professor. Revelio. That is glowing, though, so I'm very curious. Revelio. Oh, I heard, I heard a ding. Oh, you. Rebellion. I'm hearing chimes. It sounds like it's. Is it the pages? 
Getting very loud. Revelio. It hates me being over here. Uh, I guess I should go talk to the professor. Combat roll. Combat roll. Combat roll. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival? I did my best, but I'm fairly certain she suspects that we're not being entirely forthcoming. No, yes, well, really? Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Well, considering Understood, I don't really Professor. like the headmaster, now, I'm okay with that. As capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not so subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold oh. it and have a look. Are we are we going to be naughty, Professor? Are we going to uh, delete something that shouldn't be there? This represents the main quest. Completing the main quest will farther the story, unlock new features, and grant experience. The field guide map shows Professor Hecat's class in its lower section of the astronomy wing. I could get lost in this castle. I may need to use the charm compass and the field map guide to help me find a way. Attend the defense against the dark arts class. Yes, I must learn how to defend first before I start using it. Track quest. Some quests are locked by spells and or level requirements. In this case, you will need to be the required level or have the required spell to activate the quest. New spells can be earned by completing professor assignments or a quest reward. Ooh, I wonder, what, I wonder how many spells are in here. That's gonna be very intriguing for me. Field guide map shows professor e cat class in the lower set. Oh, wait, I already did that. Charm class, Actio, Levioso. We're doing dark arts. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within I'm these walls. So confused about this locket he keeps mentioning. Is it is it the thing that was over the uh, memory viewer? Is that what he means by locket? Because otherwise, I don't remember any locket. Cast charm compass. Oh. Bow. 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 <laughs> Cannot possibly be as difficult as it seems. Oh. oh god, how do I side quests are now available. Available side quests can be found in our region of Hogwarts marked by a little flag and discovered by exploring the world. These quests reward experience, but do not advance the main story. I mean Experience is always good, dude. Now, my biggest question is how do... Okay, there we go. That's how I save. Hello. I don't believe we've met. Oh, hello. I'm Lenora. Pardon me if I seem a little distracted at the moment. Is Everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. Samantha thinks I'm potty. But it's this... Painting. I never noticed it before. If I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. 
something more to this. Oh, so that the... Are there any other empty paintings like this around the school? Yes, a few. This entire place is somewhat of a riddle, to be honest. If I can work out the riddle of this one, I'll know what to do with all of them. As good a place as any to begin. Have you gained any insights about the painting since you've been studying it? I did discover that casting Lumos has an effect of some kind. But I'm not sure what to do next. Ooh. If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. <sighs> I've been racking my brains long enough. I hope you'll have better luck than I have. Lumos. Let there be light. That spot must be a clue. I should look around in case it's nearby. Okay, right side. It looks like a right side of the stairs, so. What is that, though? I'm gonna have a hard time figuring out what that is in the right corner. Oh. The right side of some stairs, so. Uh, probably this way, I feel like. Oh, it literally marked it for me. Okay, well. Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. Oh! Let's follow little magical moth. How do I... do I just stop? Ha. I knew there was a connection. I should tell Lenora oh. that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. Level 2. Where the, where the fuck is Lenora? Where did she go? Oh, she's all the way up there. God damn, she run, moves fast. Lenora! Lenora! I solved the mystery of that painting. You did? How? <laughs> oh, I could, I could do that, couldn't I? But uh, I'll be nice this time. I found the location depicted in the painting, and then I cast Lumos to guide a moth back to the frame. All very logical, I suppose. A pity I was so close to solving it. You have a knack for solving riddles. Natty's good at that too. So is Meat, although he does tend to over-explain. Well, I'm glad someone figured it out. The moth. I should have seen that. Oh. Damn, that's a lot of experience right there. Also, did I just get a new outfit? Uh, oh god, how do I... Gear, gear, there it is. I think it was here? Hey! I do not like that. I'm going back to my dark parts outfit. Rebellion. That's just that. Ooh, a door. Bam! I he I heard whispering. Are you whispering to me? Professor Black, might I suggest a ban on magic in the library? Someone has been sneaking into restricted section and... Crescenda Bloom seemed to think of the library as her own personal area in which to practice her latest incantations. It is most disruptive, one might consider. Peeve is tame by comparison to such antics. Revelio. What the fuck was that? What the fuck? What the hell? Um, what? Huh. That was neat. Not entirely sure. Ooh, ooh, chest. Did I see something in here? Spin. I did not. Hmm. How do I get how do I get in there? Rebellion. Somehow I need to put out that fire. Rebellion. I heard a chime. But first, what is this? I've always said oh, teleportation. travel broadens the mind. I want to say it's above me. But let's take a little look see around, shall we? Ooh. Locked. How much you want to bet that's probably to restrict a section?
Revelio. One of the first lovers of Hogwarts is depicted here. Rumor is that he had no tolerance whatsoever for noisy students and was known for his liberal use of the silencing charm at the slightest sneeze. Man, if I find enough of these pages... Oh, hey, look over there. If I find enough of these pages, I'll get a little free. Revelio. Hey, and look at that. Hey, cool, that's on our side. That's over here, too. Neapolitan strep scuff. Hey, that's actually a little... That's actually kind of nice with my outfit, so... But, if I don't want to see it... Yeah, there we go. I love that function. That that's just so fantastic. Lumos. Uh oh, is that where I just came from? All right. Well, what was that? Was there a? No. Okay. Come on. Run. This come with me, moth. We shall return you to your home. Revelio. Chest down. Oh. It sounds like it's above me. Or is it below me? I can't tell. Also, there was a there was a lady I heard speaking in here earlier. Is she? Does she have a side quest? Maybe. Let's see if we can find her. Oh God! Oh God! These stairs. Spin. Revelio. Can't get to that yet. Oh! Plum velvet. I'm sorry, purple? Purple robe? Um. Let's take a look at it, huh? Oh. Oh. I'm sorry, but purple robe. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Now I'm looking. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now I'm looking all... Revelio. Okay, it must be bad for him here, and I can't do anything with that yet. I'm not impressed with your Lord, though, where is that? Oh. That's neat. Revelio. Okay, there's a lot of chiming I kept getting from over in this direction. Oh! What is that? Horse. Oh. Okay. So what is that? Walrus? Uh, that looks accurate. But um Revelio. Okay. So then oh. one one set. What?
So I found a walrus and I found a horse up there. I don't know. That's a walrus. Are there any more of these things anywhere? Or is it just these two? Um. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Let's take a good look here. Up there, it's showing whatever that symbol is. Can we get that symbol up here? It does not appear we can. And plus, am I missing another one? There's like three tri- It's like a triangle. Is there like a third one? Okay, let's try, let's just do that, whatever that one is. That is showing a... Are any of those there? I have no idea what I'm doing, guys. I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing. And I hate the fact that there's numbers, because that could mean math, and I think math is like my most greatest weakness of all time. Okay, what keeps chiming? Is it us? Okay. okay. You're, uh, you're an interesting. Oh, hello, statue. I mean, Victor. Okay, I keep hearing. I keep it here in a chime. Okay. Okay, now we come over here. Revelio. Okay. Can I go up for more? Oh my god, that's so dark. What the? What in the? Oh, that's a dragon stone mural and it's moving. Oh, that's kind of, that's fucking... God damn, I am loving this. I love this environment. Holy crap. Revelio. Yeah, the sound is so far now. Ooh, 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 I saw a glowy, I saw a glow. I'm so confused. I saw they saw a glow. Revelio. Okay, let's just go back down. <laughs> oh, come on. I guess it would never let me jump over the other one, so why did I think it would let me jump over that? Huh. I, re I remember hearing something about this, though, like, that is like zero. And, the, okay, so what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Great, right, right? Nine, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, God. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, okay. If that counts as zero, that is equal nine. Okay, that says 11. Okay. That would be two. So, 13, so 12, 12 13. Alright, so then, um, okay, 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 I can do this, I can do this. 
And I say that's a 13 now, so we need a 7. So, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. It's whatever that face is. Let's see if that works. Revelio. I'm so confused! What's that? Oh! Oh, spell list! Slow both object and enemies, giving you extra plan on your next move. Glacius, freeze enemy. Levioso. I'm um, gonna go learn that. Transformation? Object enemies on an alternate form. Whether puzzle solution or harmless knickknacks. Oxio. Some of the variety of object and enemies to close range. Certain magical and heavy object requires sustained. Okay. Depulso. Descendo? Deals no direct damage, but objects and enemies that are slammed to the ground will suffer considerable impact damage. Airborne enemies will take even greater damage. Oh, okay, so that is... Uh, let's see here. I think... Levioso and Descendo would probably be very good combos together then. Okay. Fl Flippendo? Wow, okay. Fire? Of course. Slashes object and enemies from afar. Oh, okay. Disarm wands and weapons. Bombarda. Deal heavy damage on impact. Accompanied by an explosion that can destroy heavy objects. Incendo. Disillusionment? Causes you to blend. Oh, invisibility. Okay. Repairo. Wingardian Leviosa. Conjuration spell. Conjure items in existence. Altering spell. Oh. Vanish items and turn moonstones when cast within a room requirement. And of course, the dark arts. <laughs> Kill enemies instantly. Okay. Cause most enemies to rise in pain as they take damage over time. Also curses the victim, and cursed enemies take extra damage. In PBO, temporarily force enemies to fight as if they were your companions. While under your control, they take reduced damage from other enemies to prolong their allegiance to you. Also, curses the victim, and cursed enemies take extra damage. Huh. Neat. I guess I'll come back to this later. I don't know what I'm doing. Revelio. I did that multiple times here. What the frick? Statue with an grating grin depicts the medieval wizard Gregory the Smarmy. The wizard famous for inventing Gregory Unquintus Unkan. A potion that makes the drinker believe whoever gave them the potion is their best friend. Oh. <laughs> Oh, wow. Okay, man. Uh, do I go through these doors? No? Wait, I see a chest. Oh, the chest is on the other side, isn't it? Duh. It really, it really annoys me, guys. I really, want to, I really want to be in there. I want to know how to do this. I just don't understand. 2117. Okay, I did... I guess we can try for the 17. So then, 
that is nine. If that's nine. Two, three, four, five. Okay, that's five. So nine plus five. Oh, uh, why are you making me do math? Fourteen. So then we need what? Six? Mine is blinking, guys. My mind. Okay, okay. Let's see here. Two, three, four, five. Two, three, four. Where's the gecko? I think I just had a brain burst, guys. Hold the fuck on. Hold on now. 11 plus that. That is 2, so that's... God, come on, do it! I hate math so much. 12, 13. 13 so we need a 7. 7. 13. So we would want man face up there. Oh! Oh, I think I get it. I think I might got it, guys. I think I might have got it. I think I might understand how to do this now. Oh, damn it. I was already on man face. I think that's accurate. I think that's correct. Come on. Come on. You can do it. Get around that door. Revelio. I thought I figured it out. Uh, 12. Okay, 12, 13. Oh, wait. <laughs> I don't know. I thought I figured it out, but I guess I didn't. I fully believe that is correct right there. I feel like that gecko is correct. Is it maybe just the bottom one's wrong? Did I did I math incorrectly? six. That's a six. So that would be... Okay. That's for the bottom. So then we need to figure out the top one. Okay, okay, okay. So. Oh my god, my brain. Not. Not. Screw it. <laughs> I'm going. I'm going. I'm going to cycle through everything on the top, and if the top doesn't work, then I'm. I'm. I'm walking away. I'm walking away if this doesn't work. I swear to God, I feel like that has to be the correct answer. Is there maybe just something else I'm not Rebellion. knowing? Alright, I'm walking away. I'm walking away. Open up. How in the world do I get to where I need to go? What do you mean I'm currently not tracking it? I was tracking the dark arts. Yes. 
Okay, so we do need to go through there. We're going to the dark arts. No more distraction. Except for the, except for the fast travel. What the? Is that a clown? Why do students always run when Pinky wants to have some fun? <gasps> I don't know, man. No, no, stop it. Stop getting distracted. <laughs> to the dark hearts. Away. <laughs> Is that an eyeball? That's an eyeball staring at me down there. Double you've got. Levioso! Professor Hackett! Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces in your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. To the wise, age matters very little. Today, we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Ooh. Levioso. Levioso. A levitation charm. Levioso. Uh. A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now, Let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. People? Levioso! I have done it. I've gained the power of levitation. Now, let's try something a little larger. Let us begin with a basic cast. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, a surprise Levioso. is good. Well done. Very good, but the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelist, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel using only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. All right, duel time. Protego. Stupid. Protego. Levioso. Okay, Steve. This can't be your first. Let's just say I'm a quick learner. How do you Levioso. He's not on the table anymore, Professor. Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. <laughs> Trial cut by combat of giant statues trying to murder me. I put you on the spot, and you rose to the challenge. Points to Slytherin. Points Thank to you, Slytherin. Professor. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. I will achieve a, a lot. A classroom duel is one thing, 
But battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different y yes, battle of Grindelow's entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. I stand out a lot with All my purple right. elf, with my purple robe, don't I? You know what? When I'm in the school, I'm slithering. But when I'm outside, I'm purple robing it. Enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. Uh, let's see. Oh my god, that's a lot of people that want to talk to me. You're closest. I'd hate to face Professor Hecate in a duel. Oh, well, that it? That was it? Okay. Oh, I'm not much for dueling. I prefer to keep things friendly. If you know the right spells, it's dark wizards that'll fear you, Revelio. not the other way around. Ooh. I can't get any, can I? Nope. There's a lot of chests back there. Holy crap. Who are you? Huh. Always thought Levioso was for first years. Not anymore. Levioso. Revelio. Nice was, work. Miss you at a moment. You drilled Sebastian. He's strong competition. Well done. Oh, okay. Oh. Was that an Iron Maiden right there? I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? Felt more like I was dueling an expert. Didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. Well... I've dueled enough. Consider yourself lucky I held back. Huh. Fair enough. You owe me an honest duel when you aren't. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Ooh. Exclusive and unsanctioned. Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you do just it. have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. <laughs> Good. That's a teacher walks right by you. as we say that. Sure, I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. Until next time. Is there, is there, is, yeah, that's an Iron Maiden. Look at that. Level three. Rebellion. I can't do anything with you back there. Stop chiming. Teleportation. How nice to see you, my young friend. Activate. Why does it not want to activate? Hello. <laughs> Uh, apparently, fuck me with that teleportate with that fast travel. Hmm, I've always had trouble with that spell. My cat looks so Rebellion. concerned drinking that tea. Oh my god! Oh, I hear the chime. Sounds like sounds like it's like right in front of me. Maybe it's below me. Or can I? Oh no, it's even farther up. How do I get upstairs? Ah, ask and you receive the answer. Stairs. Ah, I see you. Augury skeleton. This is a skeleton of an Irish phoenix of Augury. Or, or, or Augury. An intensely shy bird who can forecast a coming of rain and whose mournful cry was once believed to foretell the death. Revelio. Huh. There it is. Lumos. 
Uh, I have no idea. Wait, or do I? No, I have no idea. Okay, let's see. There's a kind of like stained glass kind of stuff going on. There's a mural. It's. I feel like it's probably the front of the other class, isn't it? Oh. Well, god damn! Look at that. Oh my god. What the? What the? What the? What? What was that? Revelio. Oh, people in their brooms. Can I like this? What Thank you. you. Oh, pet the cat. Yes, we pet all of the cats. Good kitty. My god, there's even more. Oh, wow, I can go up even. <gasps> Wait. Lumos. Are we close? I feel like we're close to the thing I saw in the mural. Got it. Yep, there it is. Come with me, little one. We shall bring you back to your home. Return. Six out of eight. Okay, well, up we go. Revelio. Does this not have anything? Well, okay, well. Who would have thought that statue would have had a uh, thingy magic? Oh, I've already put that on there. Mine. Classic sorcerer's hat. I'm sorry, what? Levioso. How dare you? Revelio. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, what the fuck's going on in here? Um. Levioso. I'm very intrigued by what the hell's going on in that toilet. What is the one? Any other secrets in any of these toilets? Oh, oh. oh. That one's broken. I didn't do it. Handy resource indeed. How's one of those eyeballs? Levioso. Can I levitate? No. Broken. Oh, no random cauldrons in these best. These ones. Revelio. Alright, let's go to class! There's so much to fucking explore in this world, and I'm loving it. Oh my god. Oh. Really? We sometimes have to remind him to finish the lesson. Some of us don't necessarily want him to get back to the lesson. Quest to begin. Ooh! Ooh! What's it gonna look like? I can't read that. I d uh, cursive is one of my worst things too. Revelio. Oh, there's a chest and a lot of stuff over there. And of course, there's a lock. Shall we begin class, everyone? Here! Behind you! There is an open seat here. Thank you. Hello, I am Nettie. Hello. So you are the new student. 
Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <clears throat> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of Charms. Now, this will be a crucial year I feel like in your I'm education like on the art of charm work. But I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right? Now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Ah, 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 ah. I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> I mean, Do I'm, you I'm new. even remember how to perform I, I, a basic I, I don't summoning even know. charm? Summoning? Hmm? Summoning? Summoning? Hmm. Well, it seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are, and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book oh. will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. Oh, that, uh, that, that disappoints me. <sighs> Get away from me, Red! Akio. That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. Might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me. Uh, outside. Oh. Oh. That's a big. Bo that's a b big bones. So our enemies are vulnerable to certain spells and techniques in your... Oh, okay. Ah. I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> so, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> Is he building? Yeah. Oh, okay. I thought he was building a house for a moment. <laughs> so why don't we have our newest student start us off? Hmm? Oh, why is it always why is it always a new student? Huh? Why why you gotta always make the new student do stuff? Very simply, cast Akio on one of the spheres and relinquish your charm at the last possible moment. Now, uh, Akio is like gobstones. It, that's it! Happens to the best of us. Excellent, good. Stay focused. I'm so confused. Very good. Oh, okay. Very good. Points to Slytherin. But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. Okay, okay, I got this now, I got it now. You'll be the blues, just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. Misha. There we go. Back here. Too fast, too fast, too fast. Stop, 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 stop. Please stop, please stop. No. Splendid. Let us see this. Oh, 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 that was a close one. 
That is how it's done. That one felt like it came quicker. That's fifty, right? Brilliant. Here we go. Ah, we in a perfect score. And Remarkable. Oh, 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 Oh. <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. I'll say. Can I? Hey, I think I can. Oh, okay, okay. Well, little now stinker. Now you will need it. This round settles it all. Lisa. That actually saved me. <laughs> That's it. Uh, yeah. Let us see this. I totally meant to do that. Totally. That is how it's done. Nicely done. I've already won, I believe. Here we go. There we go. Gotta be careful here. Akia. Two perfect rounds. You're a natural. <laughs> Good, both of you. Well done. Points for th points to slithering? No? Okay, well, never mind. I guess not. I guess I get nothing for all the perfect scores. Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. Good game back there. I must admit, I think I underestimated you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. That's good to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. Is Wagadu much bigger than Hogwarts? <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the largest wizarding school in the world. So yes, bigger than Hogwarts. But it never seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me. It always felt like home. Is Wagadu a castle like Hogwarts? Its address is Mountains of the Moon. I, th I thought it is Hogwarts not so is like the most prestigious. What the fuck is this place? It's a beautiful edifice carved out of the mountainside. Ooh, I remember nice. the first time I saw it, the mist was so thick I could hardly make out anything at all. And I love that, that guy's sitting there, there like, oh, why do I have to listen to them? This enormous school that seemed to be floating in midair. This may seem an odd question, but is magic the same there as it is here? Mm, mostly, yes. But I did have to learn how to use a wand when I arrived here. Hardly anyone at Wagadu uses one. Why? Why? You can cast spells without a wand. Oh, yes. 
I find one less magic to be much more instinctive. Not to mention quite convenient if one is without their want. I must admit, however, that I am growing quite fond of using a wand. It seems very dramatic. It's nice to learn about another wizarding school. Thank you for asking. I do miss Wagadu, but I am glad to be here at Hogwarts. Ah, until oh. next time. Oh, I think I might have accidentally skipped on the I'm not sure. Accio and humans, if you're so. Professor Ronan reminds me of my. Well, you'd be using it on clothing, to be precise, Sebastian. You know it won't work on you. After my brother learned the summoning charm, it was constant Accio this, Accio that, cutlery flying everywhere. Quite unsafe, really. <laughs> oh, no one else wants to talk, apparently. Okay. Professor! You wanted to speak with me, Professor? Did I he? did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well. An outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? You did well, managing to best as gifted a student as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed the match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Yo. Quest complete. Charms class. Level four. Wow, I just got 20 experience from that? Oh, okay. What was I? Revelio. Nothing else besides what's behind the locked door. Hello there. You're the new student, aren't you? Hello. Hello. You wanted to speak to me? Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. Hope your first day's going well. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. <laughs> I've been fortunate. Beginner's luck. <laughs> My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be overconfident in his. Well, better see to my charms homework. I'm afraid I can't count on beginner's luck to impress Professor Ronan. Revelio. And it's just whatever's up there, which I can't get to yet, but there does look like stuff I can get to over here. Ooh, fast travel. Activate. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before activate. I invented blue powder. Why won't that activate? I don't understand. Ooh. Ooh, that's pretty. Astrology class? Oh. Gotta pet the cat. Always pet the cats. He's good, kitty. Good. Oh, he meowed. I wonder. Levioso. Akio. Uh oh. Levioso. What about the cat? Akio. No disappointing. I was hoping I could somehow pull it out from under him. <laughs> Ooh. Loosen black and white pinstripe scarf. Ooh. Revelio. Oh no, not one of these things again. Oh. Uh. Zero three and a five. What? Unicorn, what is unicorn? Unicorn is one. We need a 12? So what, that's five? So. Why does that work? I don't. What? I, uh, okay. You know what? I'm just. I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna get this stuff. Black square. Rebellion. What the fuck? Are the, the fuck? Oh, it's one of those dead things. 
blue nightcap. I'm so confused about why that worked, but the other one didn't. Whistle attack. Let's see here. Uh huh. This one seems. This one is better. Do I got better gloves? I do not. Oh. I will put on the purple robe, but then I will come over here and make it look Slytherin. No, I kind of like it. Oh. No, no, I actually like that. But I do not like the hat. Okay, I'm curious. <laughs> okay, you know, I'm wearing a wizard hat. Yeah, I have. I'm wearing a wizard hat. Are we? Activate! I want my fast travel. Oh, that's locked. I can't get in there. Rebellion. Uh, perhaps mind what you're doing there. Oh, you mind what you're doing. Complete a challenge. Revelio. Sounds like it's coming from up top. Oh. Dude, I think this would probably be like my favorite hallway here in the school. Well, maybe not hallway, but you know you know. Revelio. Bunch of trolls and tutus. Oh, that guy just that one just Yep. Tapestry of Barnbath the Barmy. This tapestry depicts the wizard Barnabas the Barmy, a foolish attempt to train trolls for the ballet. One can only imagine the impact on the arts he had he succeeded. Revelio. Oh my god, picking that up gave me 80. I don't know where I'm going now, chat guys, but I'm on an adventure. I'm on an adventure to see where these stairs take me. Oh my god. Yet that activates? Oh, at least I have a fast travel point to astronomy. Rebellion. Dear Sir Tabat, you'll be pleased to hear that I received word from your contacts at Cambridge who conceded that they had in fact been incorrect in their understandings of meteor showers. It seems that an Irish astronomer and a British astronomer both built upon the work done by an Italian astronomer. All muggles, mind you, as far as I know, to propose calculating the position of the dust at Earth's orbit as means of connecting meteors to comets. Brilliant, really. One can only imagine what they might do with an enchanted telescope. Frustratingly, it my correspondence, I did feel that I had to continue using the 
pseudonym from my days as a gentleman scholar, why I still found it rather exciting to have a secret identity, the reason irks me. I'm so looking forward to our trip later this year to Gentile Mentor. What an adventure we shall have. I miss you, dear sister, and do hope you are well. With love, Sukreshta. Handy resource indeed, your field. Revelio. There's mist in this tower. Or maybe that's just a lot of dust. Your peeves? Lumos. Um, take a look here. Oh, it might be farther up. Only thing I could think. I did not see any opening that appeared outwards. Hmm. Hello, Mr. Al. Can I? Revelio. No. Lumos. Just in case I run across that moss. There you are. Come on, little guy. Wait, what happens if I do that? Okay, he just goes back. A lot of telescopes. Hmm. Oh, wait, Rebellion. Probably not what I'm detecting, but... More gold. Where are you? You probably want me to come over here, don't you? Yep. Astronomy Telescope. This telescope is the finest stargazing instrument of its kind. Perfect for viewing the moon and the stars and anything else one might find in the night sky. Hey, you give me that experience. Alright, Mr. Moss, come with me. Gotta get you back home. Revelio. Right. Oh, I can't. Oh, okay, I, that's good to know. I can't. I'm not getting anything Lumos. else. Okay, I was about to say, I'm like, where's the moth? So cl I'm close to eight. Oh, yeah, 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 that's right. I completed a challenge. That means... Um, no, 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 not quests. Challenges. Thank you for... What the fuck is that? Oh, well. Go back to challenges. Because what is this? Legendary gloves. Gear. Ooh, that's a cop. Bookish half room spectacles. Complete side quests. Slash relationship quests. Complete two main story quests. I kind of don't want to claim that. I, I, want, I wonder if it's like that thing of like. If you claim it later on, it'll be bad at... You know what? Believe it. I want an experiment. I want to see if it will be badass if I pick it up later. Wait, what, 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 what's up with my inventory? Oh, okay. And the better question is, what is my quest right now? Do I even have one? Resolution brought over a secret dueling. Ooh. How do I get to the secret dueling area? Yeah. Oh my god, that's so far away. I don't even have anything over there. Oh my god. 
Ah, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll track that instead. <laughs> My word. Dude, the pitter patch of my feet going down this stuff. Revelio. Hey, come on. Can I talk to the ghost? That's the ghost. Hey, ghost. Hey. No? Okay. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Where's the book go? Where's the page? Gotcha. Now you're what lit. You now? Fuck you. Revelio. Yeah, stuff up there I can't deal with yet. I shall return. I'm surprised this isn't. Oh, that isn't like a mural or something. That has like something I can get. Words. <laughs> Don't get too quickly oh. simply because you had one victory over Sallow. He never backs down from a fight. Oh, is it? Oh, it's you, Ominous. Oh. Revelio. If I come over here, though, I hear a ding from right there. I can't tell if it's up or down. This might be down. Oh. Oh. Can't do shit with that. Off on another adventure, are we? I don't know. Open. Revelio. Saber. Ash Brown. I don't know. Oh, wait, can I customize my wand now? Is that what that was? No? Collection? But I thought I didn't pick those up. Pure wand V. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, wait. It's because I don't have my own wand yet. I'm still using Professor's wand. Okay. Oh. Revelio. Professor Fig, as if my schedule wasn't congested enough, the Ministry has charged me with the with arranging the rather inconvenient arrival of a new student at Hogwarts. A fifth year, if you can believe. Professor Weasley insists that they will need an escort and I a mentor to help them accumulate before term begins. I have assigned the tax to you. Please see Professor Weasley for details. Professor Phineas Nigelis Black Headmaster. God, that, God, that's a... Rebellion. His, his name is a mouthful. Oh. Oh, it's Professor Fig's office. Ambitious cloak. Oh, I got a cloak, you say? Well, well, well. Where did I find that? Oh, well, it was a cloak, so. Huh. And... Nope. It went... I'm in school right now, so we be slithering. Revelio. Can we talk to Professor? Does not appear to. <laughs> oh. I've always said that travel. Come back, roll. <laughs> Revelio. All right, all right, all right. 
What is chiming? Is it below? Okay, it literally sounds like it is coming from up here. Okay, now it sounds like it's even higher up. Oh, I swear to God, if it's something I can't deal with. Revelio. Is it really revealing to me those? Oh. Don't get two cookies simply because you had one. Okay, I get it ominous. Chest. Oh, I heard it. I heard something. Serpentine Beast Window. Although Slytherin likes to think this window is somehow a tribute to their house's founder, it is actually a serpentine beast coiled around a tree that extends from the mouth of the legendary great green man. Ah. Revelio. And if I remember, if there it is. I can't do anything with you. Accio. Levioso. Oh, wait, I wonder. Lumos. Brightly. No? Alright, well, screw me. Revelio. Wait, can we? Oh. All right then. Lumos. Um. Ha. Huh. I think I might have a. What the fuck? Well, we'll come back and deal with that in a moment. I think I might know where that is. Not on this floor. Uh, nope. I think one more floor up. Yes, I think it's somewhere around on this floor with all of this stuff. How nice to see you, my young friend. Okay, maybe I was okay. Apparently, I was wrong. Revelio. Oh, okay. Lumos. Huh? I could have sworn it would have been in here with all these uh, thingy magics. of the purifying cat pets. Hello. All right, you guys enjoy your Lumos. Little tiny hallway, I guess. I know it's a green man. I mean, not a green man, but there, there's a man in that picture with the one moth.
Hold on a second. I swear to God, if somehow. No? Alright. Revelio. I'm having too much. I'm having too much fun exploring. <laughs> Lumos. Well, where on earth is this one moss? with joy to be in the presence of such arrogance. Oh. Lumos. Don't think it's the delightful scent of gardenias you'll be unleashing. Oh, it was over here. There you are, Moth. Revelio. Locked. If I had to pick one shot, what are you up to now? Money. Lumos. All right, little one. Off we go. And honestly, what the fuck? What is with all this green smoke? To your home. my level f I'm almost level five. Oh my god. Don't get too cookie simply because you had one humans now a teacher herself. It's a wonder she's not gobbled up by her own thing. Well, outside. Revelio. I heard something behind me, but oh if I had Reparo. Oh my god. Yeah, that, that, that really kind of hurts my camera, I guess. Oh. Let me know, Please give me your secrets. And level five. Oh. oh what do you mean new gear? I thought I already equipped all my new gear. Yet, that's why. Revelio. Wyvern Fountain. The Wyvern in the Transfiguration Courtyard has a likeness to a Wyvern on top and serves as a relaxing place for students to gather. Despite rumors to the contrary, possibly started by Sir Catagon, this is the most assertedly not meant to be the Wyvern of Y, slain by the lively knight in spite of himself. Can I? Does it actually look like the fountain? No. Oh my god. Oh, wait. Wait, wait. I think I might have figured it out at the other one, so let me, let me see if I can do this now. My brain. one that is nine. 
and then that one is three, four, five, so. Okay, so I need three-headed snake. Come on. That should be it, and if that is accurate, I think I figure out how to open the door. Oh, hold on. Accurate. Come here. Yes! I figured it out! I figured it out! Alright, alright, alright. Cool, 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 cool. Circular painting? Crimson Quidditch gloves. Okay, okay. See you with some new gloves. Can I please have my gloves? There we go. I don't like I don't like the coloration. So back to black leather glue. Oh oh wait. Oh. But no, back to back to the leather gloves. Revelio. Cool, it's no longer trying to doesn't yell at me anymore. Alright, I'm happy about that. I'm very happy I was able to figure that out now. Let me out. God, that brightness destroys my brain. I heard that. Can't get to it though. Okay. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I Revelio. She'll be back in a moment, guys. I need to go use the, the privy.
All right, I'm back, and I got a donut. Got myself a donut. Yes. Let's shove this in my mouth. Mm. Mm. Oh, that's so good. Oh. Me? <laughs> What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. Ah, there you are. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. I'd wager mm. there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't there? Nothing more, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streamer. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Oh god, that's such a good donut, guys. Holy crap, I haven't had a donut in like, I don't know how long. Oh. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now. Regarding the trip to Hogsmeade, I mentioned earlier, I was about to say, I'm like, what we've am I arranged going there? to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. Mm. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. Can you tell me more about the potions shop, Professor? J. Pippin's potions stocks a wide array of potions ingredients, although they rarely sell recipes. Professor Sharp asks that they have a couple of particular recipes. Oh, okay, there we go. You. Ooh, man, I needed that. I've never heard of a spellcraft before, Professor. What is it? A spellcraft is a recipe of sorts used when conjuring objects. I shall explain more about them when you begin working with transfiguration magic. Yeah, so I could turn people into chickens. There's an Ollivander's in Hogsmeade. There is. Most people are familiar with the shop in Diagon Alley. We're fortunate to have someone like him nearby. Mr. Ollivander is a genuine craftsman and highly skilled wand maker. I would trust no one else to pair me with a wand. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. I mean, I haven't spent much time with them, but all right. But, all right, but yeah, we're going, we're going with Sebastian. I'd like to go with Sebastian. Glad to hear My fellow Slytherin Mr. bro. Mr. Sallow is a capable young wizard, and he knows the area. He'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. What is a butterbeer? Is it like actual alcohol? Rebellion. I see, oh, I thought I saw something shine over here. Our right, types of quests given to you by Hogwarts Professor is that when completed, reward you with new spells. The reward for completing your first assignment will be the Mending Charm, Reparo. Ooh, nice. Which is required to complete other quests. You can track assignments and their progress in the quest menu of your field guide. Revelio. Am I just hearing the lock? Is that what I'm hearing? Oh, 
Oh, wait, no, I see something over there now. But first, a cake. Partial transfiguration. This partially transfigured teacup, likely the soon to be reverse error of a second year, serves as a cautionary tale for those students who do not take seriously the complexity and dangers of transfiguration. Why? What? What is it? Wait, where is it? The teacup is gone. Oh no. Revelio. Now I'll just see. Oh, it doesn't chime for locks? Huh, I thought it was this entire time. Well, let's go talk to Professor Ronan. I've always said that travel brought me to Wait, what? Oh, cat! We gotta pet every cat we ever see. Ah, yes, the healing purrs. Oh shit, there's another cat. Game of the year, folks. Game of the years. You can pet the cats. Oh, that that cat got jealous, I think. Revelio. Ah, there you are. Yes, here I am. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that. The mending charm, Repero. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. We will have you casting Ropero in no time. Why must I first complete tasks to learn Ropero? No lesson or lecture can compare to first-hand experience. And these tasks should provide you with just that. Such experience is invaluable when mastering any new bit of magic. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. Uh, I mean, I guess I am a wizard. I do learn. Revelio. Oh, I see a book. I see a page. This is you... the right area. Oh, Got Come it. here. Yeah. Are those, are those my pages? Revelio. No, they're not mine. Right. What was that? Why am I hearing charm? I'm so confused. Are we here? Is it these chests I'm hearing? Wait, what? The, what are you? Oh, your hedge clippers. Oh, that's neat. A flying page must be around here somewhere. Revelio, Accio. Hi. Brilliant. Ah, yes. Revelio. Those are what I was seeing and hearing. And I'm confused. Oh, oh, I just had to find the pages. All right. Look at that. Oh, that's a pot. I thought that I was trust a mushroom. I the preliminary tasks weren't too... I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Yes, I found Let us give the old pages. mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to, to see, see some, some vigor. vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Remember... Your wand is a conduit of your magic. Oh shit, that was an X. I 
banana repair. It can be used to mend broken objects in pieces of the environment. That's it. Very good. Rebellion. If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted oh. lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. I thought cat. Oh, look at that one. Look at that one. He's got a half face. Oh my, oh God, it's Two-Face. It's Two-Face. What is one of Batman's villains doing here? We pair. Nicely done. Works like a charm, doesn't it? <laughs> Ooh. Can Rebellion. I? Can he... No? Huh? Hello. What? Are we done? Oh, I guess we're done. Why does it say there's a chest right here? Technically, like there's a chest outside. Is there like a floating chest? Maybe I'm just. Gonna... Anyway. All right, let's see here. Uh, ancient magic throw and ancient magic. Oh. <laughs> Revelio. Making sure there ain't nothing around here. Oh, well, there's whatever that is, but I can't get to it, so never the mind. But there is that chest. That was not very secretive. Fringe Peel Clockwork Scarf. Do I want no scarf? No, no, I want my scarf. Revelio. You're off, you're off the hook this time. Revelio. Heard it. Not you. Levioso. Rising. Revelio. There you are. Ooh. Why is there a kitty in a jar? Wooden cat. Oh, thank God, it's just a wooden cat. This wooden statue bears the likeness of Pangor Don, fearless feline mouse hunter and devoted student company. Oh, hey kitty. Oh. Revelio. Found it. The bell. Three Sister Bells. The Three Sister Bells are said to be a tribute to three similar named beautifully steep ridges that rise majestically over the glen of, of Aglashire. It is rumored that one can hear them ring in the glen way across the highlands when they are rung in the castle. Locals have been baffled by this mysterious ringing for years. <laughs> I wonder. Repairer. Oh. Revelio. I'll be over to you in a moment, Sebastian. Oh. Handy get, get that fast travel. Your field guide. Oh. Hello, I'm most pleased to be included. 
Oh! Hello, Mr. Goat. Huh. You know, I don't know why that kind of surprised me. I, I feel like that's probably not that... It is a wizardry school. Goblin artifacts. Horns like this were used by goblins during the 1612's Goblin Rebellion to rally troops and generally annoy witches and wizards. This horn was discovered in the aftermath of the rebellion behind Hogshead Inn, with a wedge of Gorgonzola stuff inside, presumably to mute it. Where's the Gorgonzola, though? Rebellion. Can, I, can I have it? I want some Gorgonzola. particular urn is rumored to have once borne the inscription Pioneer in Dragon Taming should not have been started with the Hungarian Horntail. Rebellion. No. Oh, it has to be this, right? Yep, there it is. Sleeping Dragon Statue. The Hogwarts motto, Draco Dronimus Nuquam Tiliostos, means never tickle a sleeping dragon. Fortunately, this particular sleeping dragon is made of stone and will never awaken. It may be tickled to absolutely no effect. <laughs> Revelio. I heard ominous whispers. Where are they coming from? Ah, ghost. Fuck off. <laughs> Another lock gate. Can I? I wonder. <laughs> no? Okay, well, that was worth a thought. I should probably, I should really turn around. Revelio. Oh, Accio. you're mine. Revelio. Oh, hey, I guess it kind of. Oh, oh. Yeah, I'm turning around. I want to go into wherever the, wherever it was. Hogsweed, Hogmead. I don't remember. We want to go there. Okay, I'm hearing a chime. Why? What are you detecting? Oh, is there something over there? Hold on. Hi. Revelio. Look at that. Mine. Confused. Would you like to stop blowing so I can no? Revelio. Levioso. Accio. Revelio. Certainly important, we can tell that. Hey, werewolf. Aha! This set of tapestries tells the tragic tale of which, bitten by a werewolf, she chose to flee from her home to protect her infant daughter and husband. Rumor has it that her daughter fell asleep to the howl of a wolf for years thereafter. Oh. Well, at least the, mo the mom was, always, was still looking after the kid. What are you picking up? Revelio. Is it above me? Is it that? 
I think it's that. Okay. Well, I don't know how to get up to that. I was really wanting to get into that. Oh, Revelio. Pretty sure that would have let me do it, but oh wells. Oh wait. <laughs> Been. Oh god, there's so much to explore and I can't help but just get go off and start exploring, guys. I am sorry. <laughs> Locked. Rebellion. History of Magic Windows! The set of stained glass windows feature Merlin, the four Hogwarts founders, and various other witches and wizards of the ages. I, I almost leveled up, guys. Ah, <laughs> uh, of course. Revelio. Let me out! Lumos. Uh -huh. Come on. What the fuck is that? Okay, well, at least it's, it's close to an open window with some weird statue thing next to it. Yeah, well, this is not it. I don't believe it's down, so it might be up. Revelio. Lumos. Hello? Oh. I think you're the Rebellion. first walk to do that. Oh! Some peaceful music. Frog Choir. Here perched the slimy yet symphonic frog that comprised the Hogwarts Frog Choir. These magical amphibians can sing in six part in harmony and hold a pitch better than most humans. Oh my. <laughs> and, um,. Uh, I'm going to use it. Good. Oh, Jesus. Revelio. What are you? I want, I want to open you. You better hope it's not like the other games where I got to stab out your eye to get your contents. You won't, you won't like it. I can tell you that much. Oh shit, I just went around a giant circle. Oh. Huh. Yeah, that's kind of good to know. Lumos. Revelio. And another lock. Are you? Let me answer. I grind need to lift some more, don't I? Revelio. Oh. Akio. Let me answer. Hold on, do I need to like Revelio Accio I don't think they're 
Oh my god, that's a big ass chest. What the fuck's in it? Patchwork sorcerer hat. Where's my hats? 10, 11. Trait slot level 3. I wonder what that means. Legendary. Do I got any new gloves? I do not. Any new eyewear? I do not. Nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. But we do come back to here and... Oh, there it is. Dark Arts Hat. Those in the touch with the darker side of magic. A hat worn by those touch with the darker side of magic. Because it's animated. But no, we wear Wizard Hat. Where are they level? I thought that was like right on the press. Revelio. They're like a bell up. Oh, there's a chest. Hello? Enter. Akio. Levioso. Oh. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Revelio. I was not expecting that. I was wondering why it gave me the option to enter. Well, this was a nice little journey. We found some neat stuff. And we figured out that frog statues that eat you will spit you out in another place. Ooh. There it is. Levioso. Akio. That's pretty loud. Repairer. No. Akio. Uh, wait, what? Wait, where's the other bell? Revelio. Oh, it's a it's a bell. Revelio. Repair. Akio. 
Pero. Rebellion. Repairo. I thought repair of my work. I thought lifting them. I, th Rebellion. I tried to hold my spells. Maybe I'm just not able to solve it, or maybe I'm just not figuring it out. Well, I want to go. To, I want to go to that one place anyway. So let's get the hell out of here. Lumos. Oh yeah, I forgot. I was actually looking for a moss. <laughs> I don't suppose it's somehow down here, is it? No. No, there's no light down here. It wouldn't be down here. Come on. Let's go meet up with Sebastian. We're going into town. Well, fancy meeting you. Nothing else. Okay. Revelio. Gonna grab this real quick. Broken broom. This broom. Broken broom belonged to Celine Wattenabbey, and is rumored to be all that remains after she insisted on demonstrating her expert lunar apparition charm to fellow third years. No one knows if she succeeded. Oh wow, well, another one. Flattened armor. This set of armor belonged to Sir Scrafalox Swap. The Heedless, who unwisely challenged a mountain troll to a game of muscle chairs. Oh, musical chairs. <laughs> what, is, what, is mu what is muscle chairs? I'm very intrigued. What, what, could, what is muscle chairs, I wonder? Hello, Sebastian. Ah, my new charge. I'm told you're in dire need of supplies, and I'm to accompany you into Hogsmeade for them. Is this your first foray into the village? Ugh. It is. I haven't left the castle since I arrived. Well, I shall endeavor to be the very best of guides, then. Hogsmeade's a charming little place. Self-contained, too. We should be able to find you everything that you need. Shall we? Yes, let us commence. Ah, people are materializing! I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to join you today. As am I. Thank are you, by the way. Of course. You're the only one who's ever bested me in a duel. The way I see it, I'd be wise to keep an eye on you. Rebellion! Right now, there's an even more of a big world for me to look for pages. <laughs> uh, <laughs> run away! Oh no! Never mind, we won't run away, not yet. Alright, where are we going, Sebastian? I'm gonna be doing that a lot, Sebastian, so get used to it. Revelio. Speaking of Weasley, she seems to have taken quite a shine to you. Has she? That's nice to hear. I heard it. I'm still surprised that the professor can trust me with anything, given my detention record. I spend a lot of time in detention, do you? Just enough to keep me well rounded. Uh, hello there, friend. I'm the only one that can see you, aren't I? Oh! Revelio. Uh oh. Okay, you look. Levioso. Levioso? Akio. No? Alright.
What are you up to now? Go on an adventure. Revelio. What is that? Oh, oh, there's so much to explore. And I just left the school that was already so much to explore. Now there's a, a world. Speaking of detention, this trip to Hogsmeade might have saved me from one. Glad I could be of service. Revelio! Scribner, the librarian, was on the hunt for me, as is often the case. Professor Weasley came to retrieve me, and I was able to convince old Scribner that I had somewhere to be. Go on an adventure. Battle world. So how did you manage to get on the librarian's bad side? Well, I suspect it's a matter of differing opinions. She thinks I shouldn't be allowed in the restricted section, and I, on the other hand, Revelio. I'm inclined to disagree. Oh, just one moment. This is an excellent spot to gather lacewing flies. They're pretty to look at. If you stew them long enough, they make a powerful potion ingredient. Ooh. Fine. Mine. Hey, it's the tulips. Wait. All right? Where are you guys again? I don't remember. They like the Rebellio. tulips. Maybe they are two, two tulips. Hello, game. Ah. Run. Oh, I can't run. Merlin's beard from the Forbidden Forest. Look. What? What's going on? See for yourself. Quite a sight, isn't it? You certainly don't see that every day. What the fuck are they, griffins? Hippogriffs? Oh, shit. Hopefully it won't yell at me. I want these. Oh, God. Fine. Fine. Got them. I don't know what they're used for yet, but I want them. Ooh, mushrooms. Leaping tadstools. Oh, so they were hippogriffs. We already named them, too. Prance Hoop and Sugarfoot. What is that? What is that? Akio. <gasps> what is that? Oh. I thought that was a cat. Rebellion. So much to explore. To the left is the Forbidden Forest. Out of bounds to all students. Then why is there a oh, school right next to it? That's the name. Precisely. They think it's too dangerous. I think they need to have more confidence in our defensive abilities. I have a feeling I'll be going there a lot. You see me just past those ruins up ahead. Oh my god, that's all that's Hogwarts over there. Holy shit, look how big that is. Oh god, that's a gorgeous view. Is there like a camera mode I can like enter? It does not appear to be something I can do. Wait, wait what? Outposts are open now? What where are outposts? Oh well apparently no, I haven't done, so never mind. Oh god, this game world. I, it looks so beautiful. Revelio. What the fuck is that? You had much of a chance to explore the castle. What is that? A oh, little carriage. It's positively enormous. It is that. I've been there five years and barely scratched the surface. Buddy, you Loads okay? To see. Faces to discover. Oh? Any you'd like to share with the class? Perhaps one day. I can't go around telling you all my secrets now, can I? You still haven't told me how you became so good at dueling. I wonder. Akio! Oh! Not what I meant to do, but it works. Three hold the gold! Yeah! Repair it. Repair? Repair? 
I can't repair it. Levioso. Accio. Levioso. Some things I can levioso, other things I really Rebellio. can. Ooh, what's this? Rapskellion gob. I'm getting quite a few things. Let's take a look at them, shall we? Oh, no, no new rope. Oh, two new outfit. Okay. Well, the Rapskellion one is quite a lot better. How do I do that again? Ah, yes, 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 yes. Ah, that's what a rapscallion look like. Okay. But. Come down there. Come over here. There we go. I'm going to have quite a few things to sell off. Revelio. Fine. Fine. <laughs> Every turn. Let us tap let us commence forth. God, that's so much there's so much to explore. Holy crap. But then again, there are like flying stuff, so Rebellion. my god, how much is there? I've always thought Thestral's pulling a carriage a bit grim. Though I suppose most people don't actually see them at all. But you can see them. Unfortunately. But you've seen quite a bit yourself firsthand too. Most notably that dragon attack. Hopefully the rest of your year isn't as eventful. Yeah. <laughs> can I do something? Revelio. Ow. I see no more crystals. There better be like a cat petting achievement. Mr. Moon. Take that. He's the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Where? Who? Not sure. Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new fifth year? <gasps> Pleasure. Uh, you might want to turn back, Mr. Sallow. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, look right at me! Eyes big as saucers! What did, Mr. Moon? Demi guys! Ugly and airy and terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you! What the fuck does he mean, Demi guys? Demi guys! I don't know what he's putting in his pumpkin juice, but he's obviously had too much of it. I've never seen Mr. Moon in such a state. What is, what is what are these? Uh, I'm not abandoning Sebastian. I just want to explore. All right, Sebastian, let's go. Oh, more crystals. Mr. Moon is quite the character. My sister Anne thinks he's lovely, but I'd say he could improve a bit as a caretaker. Oh, is your sister in Slytherin too? She is. Revelio. Rather, she was. She's not well at the moment, but she'll be better soon and back at Hogwarts. I 
think it's what, Hogsmeade? Honestly, if one could bottle the magic of this place, I don't know if it's the shops or the people, but there's just something about Hogsmeade. We all flock to it like moths to a flame. Wow. Oh, I don't the basket. I saw Rebellion. a. There it is. Fine. Oh, the gold. I'm hearing something somewhere. It's like rape. There it is. Crenwin's precious cauldron. This precious stack set of cauldrons outside Crenwin's advertised the shop wares. It should be noted that stacking cauldrons in this fashion, while merely eye-catching, is ill-advised for anyone wishing to brew a potion of any intended effect. Look at this little place. Revelio. I heard it. Oh. So how would you like to do this? Weasley told me you had a list of things to get. A wand and some other bits. Yes. Dittany seeds, some spell crafts, and some potion recipes. Perfect. Can't wait to see what you do with a new wand. And a short list gives you plenty of time to poke around the village. I just have to pop into a shop to find something for my sister. Let's meet up in the town circle when you're finished. Remember, have fun. It's Hogsmeade. Hogsmeade Village is brimming with different sites, shops, and other points of interest that you can navigate using your field guide map. Real? Wow, okay. <laughs> oh my god, look at all that stuff. Okay, let's see, let's see what we got here, what we got. Tomes and Scrolls, a specialty bookshop with wares that fulfill the promises of its names. Sp sp Spit Witches Sprouting Needs, a sprouting goods shop that sells a variety of brooms. Hey! Ollivanders, a branch of the renowned wand shop owned and operated by Ollivander wand making family since 382 BC. Hogshead, a pub and inn known for its unsavory patrons and generally uncleanliness. Pippin's Potions, an apothecary that carries a wide selection of potions and potions ingredients. The Magic Neep, a Hogsmeade supplier of fresh produce, seeds, and fertilizer. Zunko's Joke Shop, ooh, a joke and trick shop with a selection of pranking delights that includes biting teacups, inflatable tongues, and dung bombs. The Three Broomsticks. The Three Broomsticks Inn is the most esteemed pub in Hawksmead, where conversation and butterbeer flows freely. Madame Sniggle's Tree Emporium. A hairdressing. Okay. A, a hairdressing salon run by Calliope Sneedley that offers the latest hairstyles. Clatterag's Widow's Wear, a closing shop for both the elegant and the eccentric wizard. It has two additional locations in London and Paris. Hogsmeade Square. Okay. Steeply and Sons, Hogsmeade Local Tea Shop. It offers a wide selection of teas and confections. Honeydukes, a sweet shop stocked with a variety of wizardly confections. But it's known for its best for its fudge. It is naturally very popular with Hogwarts students. Brood and Peck, a beast supply shop stocked with the latest and greatest in beast spry products. And the Old Fool, an abandoned old building in Hogsmeade. Ah, oh, yes, abandoned, you say, huh? What, why is that pulsing? Why, why did I see a purple pulsate just now? What is it? Yeah, 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 what? Wait, what? Is that more? Dogweed and Death Cat, a plant shop for all sorts of magical plants. Oh! Look at that! There are five collection chests, I don't know what that is. Demigod statue, I don't know what a demigod is. And 55 field guide pages. Oh my god! At the of Snuff. Hogsmeade. 
map shows not the intro. Okay, and freedom. Rebellion. Where's that page? I hear it. I hear it. Next thing you know, it's unforgivable curse. <laughs> There it is. Wands of variety and woods and manners of flexibility, each possessing one of three magical cores. Choose their owners in this cozy, cluttered shop run by the amiable, knowledgeable Gerbold Olivenda and the profession of one craft since 382 BC. The Olivenda family are considered the best of wand makers in Britain, if not the world. I wish to have my new wand, please, and I'm immediately going to steal what's in your chest. Revelio. Speed. Ring a ding ding. Oh. I'll be right with. Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. Ah. Hello, sir. I'm looking for for a new wand. Yes. It's about time. Yes, uh, about time. Well, you're our new fifth year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest wand makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. Oh. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect one, shall we? I like this old man. Uh, no, 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 not you. Um. Ah, yes, yes, hmm. powerful core, ten and a half inches, hmm. you might do. Here, give this one a try. Well, go ahead, swish. Hmm. Nope. How odd. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. Swish. Oh. I don't think the one likes me. <laughs> well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um, we'll find you something, not to worry. Mm. No, not you. Uh, uh, mm. Perhaps. Yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Ooh, dragon heart. Let's give this one a try. It's probably not going to end well, is it? Oh, 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 goodness. Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. <laughs> These ones are not liking me. This is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. Yes, I think you might be the one. Here, take it. Uh, look at them showing it off screen. Oh, God. Purchase. Finalize one. Nope, we're not finalizing anything just yet. Curious indeed. Warm, wood, warm brown, gray, light brown, honey brown. Oh, huh. what does these do? How intriguing. Oh. Ring dark brown. What is that? Curious indeed. Is that unicorn horn? Is that what that is? Oh, I kind of like that one. How intriguing. Kind of looks like bone. Oh, no, it says wood style. What does this looks like? Curious indeed. Okay, I, I am partial to this one as well as this one. Let's take a look here. How intriguing. I'm not seeing a change. Curious 
curious indeed. Quite oh, bendy, yes, fairly bendy. I don't know what any of this is meant to do. I guess we'll do you. This serves as a core wand, known for producing powerful magic, for producing constant magic, a great range of magic. I, I mean, we we gotta choose dragon, right, guys? I mean, come on now. A dragon heartstring wand is most powerful, and learns quickly. Like, I'm very confused about. Okay, I get that this is the appearance, but I'm not seeing like how intriguing a change. At anything when it comes to this. Is it maybe the wood? Maybe the style? Oh, yes, indeed. Let me let me try this. I, I don't want to fuck anything up, like just in case somehow that is. I don't affect some stuff, but I just I want to look up something real quick. I just want to make sure that's not somehow going to affect like a st st some kind of weird combat oriented stuff. And changing wand. Yes, please explain to me. You can keep the one that chooses you, or you can customize your one style. Wood, flexibility, lengths, and core. Keep reading. Once you have selected and approaching, not sure. Okay. You don't have any effect on how strong your character can be in Hogwarts. It's purely cosmetic, so create a one that you're happy with. Okay. Before purchasing one, you can change the one style. As mentioned above, you have no impact. Alright, alright, alright. So it's just literally just all cosmetic. That's. I'm very confused at that one part then, considering. Why nothing seems to change in the wood style. But. Oh well. How intriguing. Natural corp. You know what? I want this because it kind of looks like a horn. Curious indeed. How intriguing. Is he going to say anything about those? No? Alright, Dragonheart. Yes, indeed. And... Oh god, I really can't decide. I, I, like, I like the white, but I like How that. How intriguing. I don't really like that one. Curious indeed. No, we're going with this. We're going with this. Look at that thing vibrate a little bit. Alright, dragon heart. Cherry. Dragon heart on yielding. Yeah. What do you think? Why did the music get so ominous? Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> now, 
How did that feel? Good. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. I would imagine so. A wand with a dragon heartstring core is capable of dazzling magic. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. Revelio. Yeah, I'm liking the white wand. It, re it really pops against my black robe and outfit. Yeah, that looks great. I can't go in there. <laughs> hey! Mine! Okay, that sounds very. Okay, that sounds very close. Where is it? Where are you? Revelio. You can't hide from me, Paige. Where are you? Sounds like it's now behind me. Okay, it's what? It's inside there. I don't think I can. Wait, unless I can climb on top of the building. I don't think I'm actually supposed to be up here. Let me just let me jump some fences. Come on. Wait, is this the? Oh, that's the wand shop. Thank you. Thank you for the wand, sir. Rebellion. All right, I'm coming back down here. Look at those cauldrons. I've come to shop. Well, before we talk to anybody here, what's this? Outland dueling gauntlets. What kind of what kind of fun stuff can we get here? Ooh. Back to the oh. Wait a second. I'm out and about right now. You know what that means, guys. It's my out and about room, purple. How do I look with that? I don't look that bad. You know what? I like that. I like that little hat. I like this little setup. Revelio. Alright, now wasn't this one of the shops I needed to come into, sir? Was it not? I could have sworn it was. Let me check my quest. Visit Tomes and Scrolls, visit J. Pippin's Potions, visit the Magic Neap. Uh, visit Tomes and Scrolls. I think I'm near, I think I'm near that right now, right? Oh, yep, right across the street from me. Revelio. But first, I see a floating page. Come here, you. Accio. This. Spin. Rebellio. A whole two gold. Let's go. <laughs> oh. You want to spin again? I want to. I want to see you actually do it this time. I, not just the end. Ooh, now it's a cleaver this time. One more time. Let's see if we can get the last one and see. Let's see if something special happens. Rebellion. Okay. 
all the weapons have been filed. Does something special happen, or does it just go? No, nope, it just goes right back. Okay. Two potions and scrolls. Hello, kitty. Enchanted Staircase. This Enchanted Staircase and Tomes and Scrolls reveal itself when a particular book is moved. The proprietor here, Thomas Brown, sells a variety of written products, including spellcrafts handy for conjurations. What's that? Oh! Oh, neato! Pardon me, I'm just going to explore up here. Revelio. Ah, yes. My gear slots are full. What? what? Oh. Um. Take me to my gear. Is it in here? 20 out of 20. Oh, God. Oh, my. Um. Okay, we'll equip those. We will get rid of Z. So what happens if I destroy? I don't think I get anything from the looks of it. Okay. So we must try to sell as much as we can and keep the armor I like. Charming house cloak. Oh. Well, it actually is kind of char- Wait, is that Slytherin? Hey, yay, hey, look, it is. Oh, that's nice. Oh, we're in my own about clothes. Hello, sir. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda, student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. It's good I to meet you. I think you've had a conjuring lesson then. I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest, creating something out of nothing. Of course, it is not without complexity, <coughs> but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I uh -oh. look forward to that day. And I, too, see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring oh, unique go. items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting table and a potion station. Yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Let's have a look. Let's look at what we have, shall we? Potion table with small pot spellcraft? Small potion... What is it? Is this where I can sell? I... Yeah, 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 yeah. Um... Sell that. Not as good. Ambitious cloak. No. We are not getting rid of the purple. Neither of the hat. I'm keeping those for right now. 
All right, let's see here. Beast Feeder Spellcraft. Beast Toy Box. Shopping Station. Produce a plant byproduct. Oh. Dong Kong Poster. T-shaped potion station, medium po oh, yeah, okay. Mine. Mine. If you're interested, feel free to take a look around at the rest of my inventory. Oh my god. I don't know. I, I'm not going to buy anything else. I don't know what I would need. Because you have some expensive stuff, my man. Oh my god. Revelio. Hello. Boom. I guess my magic is still red. Revelio. they take we did not kitty wow revelio i hear i hear the chimes i see you mean community garden. This small community garden is the heart of the village. It's the typical spot for growing various herbs and peaceful magic plants. Can I can I take stuff? Apparently not. Eh. Revelio. Oh, damn. <sighs> Revelio. What is that chest? Can I get to it? Ah, oh, it's one of those eyeballs. Lumos. Alright, what do we got here? We got... Okay. I feel like it's probably right around the corner I just came from. Revelio. Hogshead docks. These docks outside the Hogshead Inn offer a pleasant place to sit and relax. If one can do so, whilst only a stone's throw from whatever nefarious going on may be occurring in the notorious Shady Inn. Revelio. Okay, there's another one nearby. Oh. Sounds so loud. Did we go to the chest? Alumos. Oh. Come with me, boss. Gotta get you home. Level eight. Level up a rule. Revelio. 
Okay, I'm going inside if I can. Oh shit, I can. Oh shit, the boar head is moving. I love that. Why? I just. There we go. Mounted Hoghead. This mounted hoghead rolls its eyes and snuffles its nose as it oversees the seedy atmosphere and decidedly interesting clientele of Hoghead. Am I? Yeah, I'm still... Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. I gotta stop questioning that. Weird. Oh, well. Revelio. Levioso. Accio. And a shiny gem. Revelio. It doesn't seem to glow. Oh, I could have. Oh, look at that. I could have gone in here. I'm gonna eat your peanuts. I'm gonna drink your beer. I'm gonna spit in this pot. <laughs> I'm gonna ding it with my wand, apparently. Never mind. One for the road. Revelio. Alright, doesn't appear to be anything else down here. What's up these stairs? That's trouble. Probably one of those eyeball chest, isn't it? Yep, can't do anything with it yet. Oh, I saw that. Revelio. Side, isn't it? Welcome to J. Pippin's Pushins. Silver Spectacles. There it is. J. Pippin's Pushins. J. Pippin's Pushins is established in 1753 is the most apothecary in all Ungsmead. Where proprietors Perry Pippin sells a wide variety of potions and their ingredients. <laughs> Now, do they give me defense? Oh my god, they really do. My god, look at that. Oh my god, that's a lot of defense. These are some very, these are some defensive glasses, yo. Alright, did I get any more defensive stuff while I was out and about? I don't think I did, but let's take a little look-see. Oh, I thought I already had that equipped. Oh, I did. Why were you telling me I didn't? Oh, 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 that's right. One. A sharp, pale brown handle designed feature of metallic sheets. Yeah, I, did not, I did not really like that one, but I will slap that on my wand. Revelio. Nothing else in here, right? Nope. All right, Pippin. Let's talk. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though... I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. 
I suspect that if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. Are potions really that versatile? They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. Poison. As it's your first time in, I Curse. should mention that it's not just potion all recipes kind of fun stuff. stuff. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can, so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? Yes, please. What can I do for you today? Let's take a look here. Ashwood eggs, human skull, mongrel ear, troll, troll buggies. Leech juice, spider fang, horkalump. Invisibility potion. Ooh. A potion that enhances the drunkard's defense but covers them in a durability rocky skin. Well. Huh. Storm around the drinker, which will stun and damage nearby enemies. Reduce the drinker's spell cooldown. Spell damage for a limited amount of time. Uh, aids in healing restores. Oh, that's not, that's not so nice, though. Recipe for a potion that causes a rocky film to develop on the consumer's skin. Hope it, okay. And of course, wiggle weed. Healing Feel potion. free to take a look at the rest of my inventory. Or come back another time if you're in a rush today. Am I not able to sell one stuff here? Doesn't seem like it. Thunderbrew, invisibility. I don't have that much money right now, so I will save my money and just get the free stuff right now. Revelio. Grind for me. Revelio. I know what store it's in, but... It has to be inside the shop, right? I saw you back there! Currently run by Sirona Rang. And allegedly, as old as Hogsmeade itself, the Three Broomsticks is the long-standing gathering spot for villagers and Hogwarts students who want to enjoy a butterbeer or fire whiskey. Revelio. like it. Or they're like right outside. Ooh. Elegant casual uniform. Daring cloak. Revelio. My god, this is quite a big oh my. How far up can we go? I don't think there's anything over here, but oh. Oh wait, no, that's outside. Hold on a second. At least a floating page behind this shop. I need to get that before I move on. Oh, of course, it's locked. That's some nice, relaxing music, though. I enjoy that. Oh, God, that's a flashbang right there. Here. You're mine. Rebellion. Uh, challenges. G 
gear apprentice reward. Hogwarts regalia symbol. That's probably a scarf. Is this just transmog or is this actual physical gear? I don't know. <laughs> oh god. Ugh, there we go. Revelio. <laughs> I don't think I need to go in here, but let's take a look, shall we? Oh my, oh my word! What's it gonna do? Uh, oh! Oh! So, an amphibious surprise awaits anyone who tries to wash their particular with this particular bar of soap. Once submerged in water, a cohort of wiggling tadpole hatches right out of the suds. That only works if you weren't doing a bath. Rebellion. I'm not sure what I just picked up. Bewildering can of mystery. Can I do it again? Ooh. Don't push. Push it again. My favorite among pranksters, the dung bomb reduces a foul odor, causing anyone in the vicinity to evacuate post haste. Alright, there's something else in here. Is it right here? It sounds like it's coming from right here. Right? Rebellion. Sounds like it's right there. Outside? There it is. Zonko's Junk Shop, frequented regularly by Hogwarts students and villagers alike. Zonko is place to buy pranks and jokes and hugs mead. Revelio. Butter beer barrels. These barrels contain the popular wizarding drink, butter beer. It is served both cold and hot and has a slight alcoholic content that seems to impact, impact house elves much more than humans. Ah. Oh. Down this way, isn't it? Hear you. That's that's the bar. I wanna go up here. Rebellion. Wait. Oh, there was a door right there. Oh, let's take a look at that. Savvy traveler known that some water wells may have more to offer than a relatively innocent incoxious water well in the village of Hogmeade. What does that mean? There's so many things to discover. Like that book page! Revelio. Oh, kitty. 
good kitty. Good. Did I just get 320 for petting a cat? Hold on, what? Or that just me grabbing the page? Is that with a big old number to pop up? Revelio. Morgan the Fay has an unearned reputation. Morgan the Fay. Sure. It's gonna mess up some tea break. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Thank you. Sneakoscope is a type of dark detector and will spin, whistle, and light up when it detects someone untrustworthy nearby. It should be used with caution, however, as it will alert the untrustworthy to the user's presence almost immediately. <laughs> Revelio. Mannequin. Unlike the enchanted mannequins favored by students for dueling practice, the mannequins at Glad Gladrag serve only as a means to display the latest of wizardry fashion. Rebellio. Alright, I think that's outside. Can we talk to him? Hello? No? That's quite loud. Hey, you know. There it is. Glad Rag Weathered Ware. Founded in 1750 and with location in Paris, London, and Hogsmeade. Offers a variety of withering garments and accessories. Mr. August Hill and his associate Otto Dibble happily help all those who wander into the shop. Enjoying in particular the challenge of the customer with less, less fashion in a sense than both. Kitty. Alright, where, where do I need to go? What's my last place I need to go to? The Magical Neep. Where the fuck is that? Oh, there, oh my god, I'm so far away from that. Let's go! I think I might be able to be quicker to go this way, so let's find out. Revelio. I see you. Uh, oh, oh. No, 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 don't let you run. Revelio. Oh, oh, oh. Can I make it across? Yes, I can. Accio. Thought I saw something up there. I've leveled so much just from game pages. Like, oh, that's, a, that's a massive pages. I mean, not pages. I got, I got pages on the brain at this point, guys. This card belongs to Timothy Tess Tessadale, who runs the Magic Neep. He enjoys being in the sick of things and engaging with customers outside the shop. Hello, Timothy. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Ah, oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you, then. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo! Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way, and this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. 
Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. In He's addition to sea. seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dittany seeds? Whatever Dittany Let me seeds guess. are, sure say. something fresh. Unlocks the ability to grow Dittany in small pots. I don't know what a Dittany is, but we're about to find out. You have a look around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your interest. Fertilizer. Well, that's everything. Driveling Better fruit. go and find Sebastian. Flux weed, not grass. Mallow sweet. Sh Shiver fig? Huh. Alright. Rebellion. Alright, we're gonna lay that off because I think my I think my ears are hurting a little bit from hearing that constantly go off. What the fuck is that? What is that? Oh that's a bat ow. And I do it anyways. <laughs> Don't mind me, guys. I'm just robbing your graves. Don't mind me at all. Oh, well, never mind. Revelio. I don't know why I ran out over here, but I felt like there was probably something. But no, no, I was wrong. I was not around. Still doing it. Rebellio. Maybe it's down there. Can I climb there? I cannot. Disappointment. Abandoned shack? Oh, yeah, it is. The proprietor of this abandoned shop is said to have used a shrinking charm to aid in storing his inventory. However, a slight miscalculation ended up, for all intent and purposes, vanishing it. Can I get in? Ooh. Dark Sun Hat. Revelio. Lumos. Rocky crag. Okay, well, there was plenty of rocky crags this way. Sheep. Levioso. <laughs> no, no, there's no escape. There's no escape. <laughs> There you go. Akio. Levioso. Back up you go. Can I just keep making you go up with every cast? Nope. Lumos. Revelio. Lumos. Hello, go. I don't know if this fall damage. That'd be terrifying. That'd be pretty bad if I got, just died from that. <laughs> now let's just take a look at that. Oh, hey, Akio, come here. Lumos. All right, so. So it looks like it would be if I own my right side. No. Oh, that, that helps. There's some boxes right there. All right, all right, all right. Oh, there is a little fall damage. I saw a little tick. All right. 
so it'll be to my right side. Lumos. There's no trees. I just oh god. Oh, never mind. <laughs> never mind. Sebastian! Oh, is that a is that an eye chip? Yes it is. Okay, well. To Sebastian away! Sebastian! Dance of Kata Candy. Alright, what else is in here? What else is in the candy store? I'm just gonna eat some. Oh! Oh god! Levitating candy! Revelio. Oh, well. Fizzle with bees! These delicious sweet rumor to contain billy wig stings. Or so small sherbet balls that, when consumed, will levitate one a few of a few inches off the ground. Oh, I figured that out before you told me that. <laughs> what is this? Oh, that's neat. I love that. Rebellion. Where is it? I wonder if there's a different one over here. Or if it's the same thing. Doxy Floss. Nope, still the same old cotton candy tentacle. There it is, that's what I was hearing. Exploding bomb bombs. These traits explode when eaten. Although they are unlikely to cause serious injury, one is advised to chew was carefully. Revelio. Do I get to try? No? Try these. What's gonna happen? Oh! Fire breath! Pepper imps. Pepper imp. Okay. <laughs> Anything else I can try in here? Ooh, what are these? There's a picture of an elephant. That was great. I love that. Alright, what else? What else is there in here I can eat? I'm gl I'm actually I'm very glad to cut the candy store caught my interest. Ooh. Oh, it's just cake. Is that, is that, are those candy feathers? I guess so. I'm just 
just gotta eat all of this. Revelio. Okay, I hear a ding. Oh, I think it's outside, so. Probably the tree. Ooh, let's get that fast travel. There we go. Hengist of Woodcroft. This statue is of Hufflepuff Hengist of Woodcroft, believed to be the founder of the village of Hogsmeade. After having been driven from his home by muggle persecutors. Revelio. Alright, Sebastian! I officially have all of my supplies. Excellent. Did you get what you needed for your sister? I did. So I suppose the world is our oyster now. Let's see what else we can get up to. A village made up entirely of wizards. What Draw it away from the building. Away from the village. That was uh. Oh, there's another one. And it's uh, dodge. Are we weakening him at all? Keep at it. We'll wear him down eventually. Akio. Ow. Atachi! What was that? A taste of his own medicine. Nicely done. Let me open. Look out. <laughs> That's right, thundering lout. He's faltering. Ah, Two more hits why? to do the job. All right, Agent Magic, let's go. Like a balloon. Goodness, a second troll. Did you two take on a fully grown troll by yourselves? I suppose so. Yes. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? We are, and we were glad to help. I'm just I'd happy that the candy is shop is still okay. Look at them dancing Worth back there. Like that. The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed. Perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, officer. Singer. Officer Singer. And thank you, again. I felt like the, I felt like they were dressed like a cop. Oh. Reparo. Lucky they didn't do more damage. I'll go and see what he wants. Just time to do clean up, clean up. Can we fix it? One less thing for Officer Singer to worry what about. What the fuck? I didn't do that, did I? Repair it. And time for the big boy. Repair it. Revelio. Where is... Ah, oh, in here. 
Let me enter Mr. fashion. Hill, just singing your praises. Gonna just yes. Little tea break. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself, uh, Augustus Hill, Clothier Extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin, but I can offer you something much more useful. I own glad rags with Claire, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. And as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like oh, to give God, you no. one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. Uh, now, uh, let's try this on for size, shall we? Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. Well, I can't see what's under my robe because my robe's on. Well, let's take a look at robes, I guess. Yeah, honestly, I really don't like that robe that much. Ah, a cape. Fur coat. Okay. <laughs> I kind of like that. Oh, that's exactly what I'm wearing. Just better. Celtic hero cape. Ooh. Distinguished school cloak. Runic robe. Oh, I do like that, but if only it was purple. What's this gonna look like? Traditional school robe. Oh. Eh. Oh, well, I'm wearing better, but yeah, I'll still take it. I'll just sell it right back to him. <laughs> and let's take a look. That is that. Uh, I wanted to keep one of them at, at all times. Just so, is there a way I can lock these so I don't accidentally sell them? Can I can I go back in? No. Okay. I'd say we've earned a butterbeer or two, wouldn't you? Might help me forget that I was almost pulverized by a troll. I'd say that I agree with you. Perfect. The three broomsticks is just this way. All right, and now, to do, come on, oh, no, wrong one button. All right, turn off my robe real quick. All right, Plenty so for your I want to see today. what the Celtic looks like. Oh, damn, I really do. Make me look like a Vakken. How much is it? Oh, my God. Let me compare. Oh, God, that would be so much better than anything I'm wearing right now. Holy crap. Plus, it makes me look swanky. Regal Sleep Nocturne Teal Ensemble. Eh, not so much. Wasn't there another thing? That was Celtic. Ah, yes, that was the cape. I mean, it's only 500 gold. But at the same time, I would probably find something better. Oh, no, no, no spending. I kind of want the fur coat, though. <laughs> but no. All right, back to my gear. Where's my better cape? That one? Yep. 
that's my better cape. What about my outfits? That is the one I am wearing, okay. Ooh. Wait, no. I don't know what that nine is, but I'll slap it on just because it's better. No glasses. My god! That's a big old boost in defense! Yeah. Switch over to that. Or that. You know what? Got a fedora. Let's see what the fedora looks like. Where is this for again? Alright. Gloves? No, nope, I don't have any new gloves. Alright, I gotta make sure. Charming House Cloak. Traditional school robe. I need to sell off my school robe. So much equipment. Today. Take your time. Uh, traditional school robe. Traditional school robe. There it is. Is that not where I'm wearing? Oh, no, I'm wearing that, but I have transmog of that. Okay, okay. I wish I, I wish there, I knew where there was a chest that I could, like, I don't know, stuff stuff in, if, if that does exist. Let's see here. Traditional school robe. Um, I keep that for the transmog. And let's come over here a moment. Perfect prefect. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Perfect stylish. There we go. Alright, we do not want to get rid of the zero defense. We want that so we can get rid of those two. Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. That, get rid of that. There we go. That should open up quite a lot of my inventory space. All right, Sebastian, let's go. Let's go get a butter beer. Assuming it isn't utter bedlam in there, we might even meet Serona, the owner. She's a good one to know. Can, can I stop staring off to the right? We're, like, dude. No rhyme or reason to spy on this guy, but all right. You could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who's this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. They know 
see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing? Oh god, they Victor saw us, Rookwood. dude. Vanrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. Don't mind us. <laughs> Hello. Be casual. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Now, what can I... Oh. There's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Ooh. Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one. Single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thanks for this. My pleasure. I will say... Trolls in Hogsmeade. That's never happened before. Well, it's happening now. That's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... <coughs> uh, uh, Speak of the devil. What time, name? Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? Your clientele's not what it used to be, Sarona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. Oh! I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. No, thank you. My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. Bar fight. Bar I fight. Said, Bar my fight. My friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come on, bar Come fight. Be the three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Or not. Let's take okay. our guardians elsewhere. Can't drink butterbeer forever. Maybe I can. You don't know. You don't know me. You don't know my bladder. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls? Ranrock and Rookwood? What are you not telling me? A lot. I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. And on that note, I think we should head back to the castle. Revelio. Let's go and eat some bread real quick. Although they're a muffin. I really wish he would stop staring to the right. I'm certainly glad Serona was there. Told you she was one of the good ones. I can see that. She didn't seem at all intimidated by Rookwood and Arlo. I think you'll need to tell me why Victor Rookwood has you in his sights. But we can talk later. For the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley's certain to hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. Don't want to risk another detention for getting back after hours. You must return to the calm room for night. Access the map. Okay. Select the Hogwarts button. Uh, is that where I need to go? Grand Series? Ah, there it is. Field guide challenges are. Oh, okay, I guess I won't read that. The, oh, God dang, I can't read any of those hints. Loading way too quickly. Which rewards like spells, new collection items. Consult the questing log to help you decide which. <laughs> oh, and with me back in school, I'm gonna put on my school uniform. Don't want to wear that. You know what? I'm gonna wear that. It is charming, isn't it? No scarf. With a cap. 
Maybe if a door. What? Oh. Blue Rock and no hat. Oh, wait, actually. Actually. Hold on. Yes. You receive an outpost. What's an outpost? This is the first I've ever gotten. Come and see me. I discovered something in the locket we found at Gringotts. I really wish. I really wish there was a more. I really wish it wasn't like concursive, guys. It's very. Uh, Rebellion. No chest still. Do I know? Come and see me. I discovered something in the locket oh. we found at Gringotts. I like that. We actually spoke afterwards. That is that in this room? Oh wait, that's that locked chest. Yep, I can't do anything with that. Never mind. I got like a little castle back there. Uh, where are you, my dude? You are at a place I have not discovered yet. What? That's not right. I rem oh, okay, there we go. I was about to say. The progress field guide challenge. Visit the challenge menu to review your challenge progress. I don't Revelio. I I can't get to that chest yet. Floor. Professor, I'm glad to see you. And I you. Thank Merlin you're in one piece. I heard about the attack. Trolls in Hogsmeade? I beat the Sir, crap the out of The trolls yeah. were wearing armor. It had that dark glow like the dragon collar. Goblin silver. Ranrock used it to control the dragon. But how? And why send trolls to they were there because of me. I overheard Ranrock talking with Victor Rookwood. Ranrock was in Hogsmeade with Rookwood. The trolls were Ranrock's distraction so that Rookwood could get to me. And he would have had Serona and the patrons of the Three Broomsticks not intervened. This is great news indeed. If Ranrock's goblins and dark wizards are after you, they want what we found in that vault. Uh, yes. Speaking of the vault, do you think that Ranrock is working with any of the goblins at Gringotts? I do not. Gringotts goblins aren't typically the friendliest of beings, but they have a great deal of integrity. Integrity! Now, I dare say, after what happened to that poor banker, the goblins at Gringotts are no followers of Ranrock. And Ranrock does not, will not tolerate them going against his word They're either. The, locket. the one murder he did. You said you discovered something in it. Wait. Yes, yes. Right? I discovered an uh, inscription. I, someday I'll figure when out. When I names. read it aloud, this it's map. This is my first day. Clever enchantment. It's a map of Hogwarts, to be sure, but I do not know where it leads. It leads to the library, a restricted section, to be precise, and a bit beyond. I see traces of magic there on the map. I suspected you would see something. Shall we go? I appreciate your enthusiasm, and I'm eager to discover what we may find there as well. But if our experience at Gringotts, let alone what happened to Miriam, taught me anything, it's that the path we're on is terribly dangerous. I'd like you to work with Professor Hecate a bit before we continue. But sir, how dangerous could the library be? Perhaps we're only after a book. Perhaps we are yeah. only after a book. Usually libraries can be apparently anything. very dangerous. Once it's you've a magical your world, my dude. Magic further, come and see me. I'll let Professor Hecate know to expect you. Spin. 
thing. Let's see, are there any like side quest markers on here or anything? I said on I don't I astronomy tables. I've not discovered any? I would have thought I have. I feel like I've ran across quite a few. Dimmy guys statutes. I still don't know what those are. Is that a side quest? Revelio. I think it's below me. You can't imagine how It looks even more down below me. This now is telling me to go up. It's like right there. Is it still down more? Hold on. Is that little dot on top of it telling me it's up or down? Let's find out. Okay. Right now the dot is on top of it. Dot is still on top of that little symbol. Aha! Uh -huh. Can you help me? Hello? Were you calling me? I was, yes! Thought you might be interested in joining me for a bit of an adventure. adventure. Following a treasure map to be precise. Slight respite from battling the odd troll, I should think. Asked Poppy if she'd be interested as well, but couldn't drag her away from her puff skein. I found two maps lying about, both leading to locations around Hogwarts. Care to have a look at one? Following a Hogwarts treasure map? Count me in. Wonderful! Hogwarts fascinates me! You can keep whatever treasure lies at the end of your map. I'll be satisfied just knowing where it leads. Where do you suggest I search first? Hmm... Based on a cursory review of your map, I'd suggest somewhere near Hecate's classroom. Oh, wow. Really? How convenient, huh? <laughs> Very well. I shall take a look She's if I can start find the time. Fair enough. Classroom, meanwhile, make class. Anything. Go to her classroom. Oh, oh, uh, uh. Okay, that actually looks familiar. And uh, okay, that's out in the courtyard. That is. How do we go from here? Rebellion. And that chest is probably right below me. I think that's where it is. Oh, nice to see you, my young friend. Let's see here. Da, 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 da. Track this quest. Disillusionment. I wonder what that is. Alright, let's get to her classroom since he's like, starts at the classroom. Wait, I'm confused. Hold on, what? No, I want the map. The map. The map. There we go. Let's learn to fire. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I'll just come over here. Talk to Lush. Let's uh, see, that's about the dueling club. Okay, will this lead me somewhere? There does not appear to be a tracker for that. My mind got confused. Okay, we'll just go to he we'll just go to her classroom. 
Purge defending Hogsmeade against Trill. You know what? I wonder. Is that cauldron still in the bathroom? Yes, it is. Leviosa. Akio. Oh, I can't make it come with me. Don't mind me, folks. I'm just running in the halls. For a skeleton. I'm on the right track. Oh. Oh, wait. Which way the way? Right now, sir. If I remember this correctly, I think down here would be the head. No? Alright, well, never mind. Wait. Wait a second. Reveal? Revelio. No, okay, well. Oh. Me. Hello. Are you alright? Don't you know who I am? No. Zenobia Noak. The girl whom everyone at school hates for no reason. Oh. Everyone hates you? Why? Because Hogwarts is full of bullies and spoil sports. Leander Pruitt's one of the worst, that no talent moon mind. I wanted to make some new friends, and so I brought my collection down to the common room. My gobstone collection, that is. I was hoping someone would want to play. Are you familiar with gobstones? Little balls, like marbles. Grand game. And if you lose, they spray you with a foul-smelling liquid. Uh... That sounds awful. Maybe... Maybe that's why people don't like you? <laughs> but, you know what? Interesting. Gobstones? Sounds like a fun challenge. That's what I tried to tell everyone. <sighs> People can be so cruel. Just because they're sprayed all over with smelly gobstone spit, it's their own fault for losing. Imelda is one of the worst losers. Everett and Astoria are terrible as well. And now those poor losers have taken my gobstones and hidden them in very high places all over the school. <laughs> I have done the same. Sounds as if they... Rather an overreaction on their part. I'll say. Anyway, I can't work out how to get them back on my own. I don't think I know the necessary spells yet. I need someone, perhaps a selfless and talented fifth year, to help me. How very specific. Haven't you any friends at school? Not really. Natty said hello once, but not a word since. Do you have any suggestions on how to get your gobstones down from their hiding spots? If I knew that, I'd get them myself. Whoever hid my gobstones that high got up there somehow. I'll see what I can do. I'd appreciate the help. If you do find all of my gobstones, do come and see me again. I'll be back to playing Snake Pit and Jackstone by myself in no time. Okay. No, but no, I don't want to go look for them right now. I don't like that it automatically took me off my thing. Okay. Don't tell me to go down there and then reverse. Oh, look at those eyeballs. <gasps> I believe we have some matters to discuss. You following me, eyeballs? But you like it? You like what you see, huh? Is that what you want, huh? Huh? Can I... Can I put the eyeballs out? No? Okay. All right, Professor. I'm here about the new spell you wanted to teach me, Professor. Good. Professor Fig indicated a certain urgency to you completing your defensive magic assignments. As such, you are to learn Incendio, the fire-making spell. Ooh, Handy like for lighting torches, fire. burning away spider webs, and, when necessary, defending against those who would wish to do us harm. Sounds uh, versatile. Quite. But before we get started, I'd like you to complete a few tasks. It's always a few you tasks. may be surprised by some of them. 
Astonishing how much students don't think their professors know. Is when it gonna be like the last time where I just went around catching flying pieces begin of working paper? On incendia. Is that your task? You know where to find me once you've finished. When two rounds of cross seems crossed ones isn't as secret as it's believed to be. That complete a round of spell combination practice with Lucan What's that? That must be uh, that, yeah, that, I think that must be the dueling area. Well, as this one might seem closer considering it's already leading me somewhere. Ah, uh, look at that view. God, that looks beautiful. Revelio. Less in dire straits, it is probably best to avoid this particular toilet as it is allegedly one of Peeve's favorite pranking spots. Whee! Oh, well, there oh, you go. Again. Here I've come from the toilet bowl where she said I could swim. Did you practice a mole? As long as for only one time per week, I can plunge the boy's lavatory. Not for the week. Please, Peter, you might be late. He tried to stop me, did rancorous cop. Uh, Sought to trap me, confined me inside of a jar. But he failed, as did his containment jar. So I took my any more surprise bathroom cold? It was granted my the privileges hell? be handsome indeed. Or I'd find Cake? Cannon, and so she agreed. To tore up a contract uh, with I guess it's locked. Yep, it's locked. Okay, I can't get to the other one. Revelio. Lacklinda Lanky. This statue depicts the wizard Lacklinda Lanky, a tall, slender wizard who appears quite proud of himself for what precisely no one knows. Map of Aglashire. This map depicts Aglashire, a region in Scotland which contains the Head Bridge, native home of the Hebron Black Dragons. Oops. Why is that like glowing? Leviosa! Accio! Well, might not have the correct spell for it. Revelio! Orange Eye of New Guckles. God, when I gain the ability to fly, there's going to be so much to explore. I don't even know where to begin. And it's already so hard to explore already on foot. There's just so much. Lucan's just over there. One moment. Revelio. Levitate. Levitate. Revelio. Oh, damn. That door did not like me being near it. Uh, uh, in here or? I 
Okay, I can't get to it. Okay, it's behind that locked door. Hello there. I would like to talk. Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinated duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. I seem to have a knack for dueling. Then you've come to the right place. How does cross ones work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. It's our way of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. Me. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? Of course. Dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in crossed ones, you can duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. So, care to step into the ring? Get me in the ring. Let's fucking do with this! Let the fireworks Dark begin! Dark magic! We'll make you regret signing up. Yeah, there you are. Breaking through yellow shields with control spells, like the levitation spell, Levioso. Target's lock lets you track enemies without aiming. Okay. Levioso. Up you go. Akio. Levioso. Get up. Come here. wasn't wrong about you. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. In fact, the second duel is ready when you are. And as a fully initiated member, you now have access to the official Crossed Ones training dummy. Ooh. Very good way to master spell combinations. Come and see me and I'll set it up. Again, congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well fought. Hope to see you back here again. Where's the where's the dummy? Oh well. Hello, Lucan. May I use the training dummy? Of course. I'll fetch it and give you a list of combinations to practice. Ready to have a try now? Yes, because that's part that of my would be quest. Wonderful. Be sure to cast all your spells before the dummy lands. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. Oh my god, that is... Okay, what is... what? Okay, first off... Akio! I pressed it. You looked good out there. Thank you, Lucan. I say better to discover one's weaknesses during practice than during a duel. You'll be a fearsome challenger now. Quest completed. Alright. Hello, Lucan. And time is for the next the round of final ones all set. Why, yes, it is. I've got a great match lined up. Ready for another round? I'm ready. Let's do it. Brilliant. 
Are you dueling with a partner? Uh, yeah, we'll do with Sebastian yes, again. Sebastian. Then let's get to it. Ready to get thrashed? Apologies in advance. Why are there three of them? Their violet shields with four spells like summoning charm. Oxio. Okay. Betting? I could bet. Bravo! I gave it my all. You did indeed. The other duelists have already taken notice of you, but after that last round, they'll really have it in for you. You'd better keep practicing if you want a chance at winning, or at least surviving the next round. I'll let you know when we're ready. Hope to see you then. The next round is for all the gobstones, so to speak. Assignments all finished. Revelio. Nothing that way. I feel like it's probably right in the middle, but better explore as much as I can around here real quick. The Well of Four Beasts. Some students believe that a wish made over the Well of Four Beasts, whether near to Thrustle, Griffin, Chimera, Hippogriff, will come true for one uh, who has gained the trust of any of the four. Oh, I got my words. Revelio. Oh, I got a level from that, too. That works out. Okay. And with that... I am going to call it a night, everyone. Oh, man. I usually don't stream this late into the night. Well, into the morning. <laughs> Did I? Oh, God, now I got a double save. Here we go. No, I shall see you. I shall see you. Tomorrow, I might. Honestly, I might be playing this instead of Bioshock Infinite like was originally planned. <laughs> so, until then, good night, everyone, and see you tomorrow. <laughs>